This is the KP show. It's not the PK show. <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. That's what's up, dude. Uh, Chris, uh, getting, yeah, I mean, you didn't have to wait for shipping. You didn't have to do all that stuff. So, I mean, convenience and all that, it was totally worth the money. It's a solid uh, video card for sure. Um, I was looking for getting a laptop with that same video card, but it was going to be expensive as crap. I don't want to go. Um, you could probably hear T Bone and stuff. Let me let me mute them. I try. Um, also, that's pretty decent. To solid, it's cool. You got a solid state drive in there for just a few games you want on there. That thing is primo. SSDs are where it's at. Uh, 16 gigs is more than enough. And that i7, I mean, I don't know which uh, which generation it is, but as far as I know, uh, Intel's and i7s are really freaking nice. So. That's what's up. Congratulations, my friend. If you have PUBG or you get PUBG, we should definitely get down sometime. That is what's up. You're going to have to get yourself onto the Discord now. Discord. Um, yep. Welcome to my stream. We're about to do a little bit of uh, PGRP Bastion because I've been really hyped for this server and it's freaking amazing. I'm a uh, cardigan ramshackle. I'm going to be blacksmith extraordinaire. <laughs> All right, let's get this show on the road. I'm back. Welcome back, sir. I am KP, you son of a... You stopped trying to trick us. You stopped trying to trick me. First you attacked me with the Triceratops. I did not attack you with anything, sir. And now this. All right, looks like I'm going to have some some guests on my stream tonight. Uh-oh. You are a guest. Who's else? You, you. I don't want to be a guest. <laughs> guest starring High Vi or not High Visions, Wilson and the Cool Rungeon. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun. <laughs> That's why I said, I, I said, wait, Wilson. I wish he was here. I Dr. Smile. Horse for me. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Can I wish swear? there was a, a <laughs> sure. It's a mature stream, oh, good. and Willow's well, not around, anyway. so <laughs> probably would have anyway. Most definitely, you don't you don't censor yourself for anybody. That's fine. I try to. <laughs> I just can't. <laughs> can't contain the beast. Can't control. Can't control them. Might have to turn you guys down just a bit though, just in case I start I'm RPing. Right over here. All right. This is the KP show. It's not the PK show. What am I? What do I need? Oh, I'm trying to get some more melee. Melee. All right. Looks like I have to go out and get my own damn obsidian. Wow! I found firestone. Nice. <laughs> Damn this freaking thing is loud. What's loud? The storm. Oh yes. Oh, <laughs> people are buying scissors like crazy. Oh yeah. I hope they're happy because they can't fucking use them. Why can't they use them? Oh. I thought you had to have all kinds of accomplishments to use scissors. It's oh, to, to, get. to get more hairstyles, but if you want to cut your hair, like Wilson, he, he likes to keep his hair nice and trimmed, and he doesn't like a beard. Oh. He likes to stay well, clean they don't cut. don't last long enough, though. I mean, how do you guys afford to keep them going? Oh, I give free repairs on scissors. Oh. Damn, isn't that an obsidian? Uh, yeah, but it's only like two. Okay. <laughs> you broke, son. <laughs> yeah, I, I am having an issue with Obsidian right now, so I, I may have to change that policy. <laughs> that's, what, that's what I was thinking. Only because I have not... Uh, I don't even have a pair of scissors for myself, although I like my, my, I like my stuff fully grown out, so it's not a problem for me. Yeah, same here. Like, I like my big old beard. And I like uh, my hair... my. I was the first one with the cornrows, and everybody's rocking them. Because as soon as you get on the horse, you get that achievement. And you can oh. wear the cornrows. 
I don't either. I want my ponytail. I love the corn. Well, not Abe. Abe doesn't give a shit. Oh, I just care about this crystal people. back. T-bone. He doesn't do this crystal. dang crystal. Dang, it's only four orbs. Nice. I just saw a 31. <laughs> Come back here. <laughs> 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 this is funny shit I've seen in I don't know how long. <laughs> oh yeah, it was great. Um, yeah, this guy, or Mr. Pudwacker, might be hustling pretty dang good for this dang obsidian. For all his things, he wants freaking forty coins for twenty-five pieces of ore or something like that. Oh my god! I can go down the street <laughs> and get that ore and. Look at these split. I, I, there, I can get the river rocks in town and get that ore quicker. For oh, cheaper. Yeah. That's what I was doing at first. I laugh at people who sell certain things for lots. And I feel Ooh, sorry you got for hunter leggings. Buys it. I can freaking put a campfire on the wall. What the heck? Yeah, you can. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that is cool. I want to do that, but it would be against immersion rules. Yeah. Well, I mean, you could like, I mean, no, it's a campfire on them. Okay, I guess <laughs> since it's a campfire, but I was like, I could find a way to justify it. You just wait. You just can wait. <laughs> but how much well, is she I selling can, doors for? I could use some more doors. Oh, I'll, I'll buy them. Three. Freaking line the outside of my house in it. One, two, three. That's good. Oh, high quality bed. Oh, shit. I may have to go get that. I'll buy this for now, though. <laughs> 80 gold for this here uh, high quality bed. I'm going to be spiffy once I get this bed. I'm gonna be the most spiffiest sleeper in the whole of Bastion. Uh -huh. I hope this is my bed. <laughs> oh, I wonder if Mr. Hamlock's around. I feel like there's something I need to talk to him about. Oh, hello there. Hello. Mr. Hamlock. H how are you? Uh, uh, I, my name's uh, Cardigan. I don't believe we've oh, met. No, I, I don't know if we have. My name is Cora. Cora Williams. Oh, very nice to meet you. Oh, oh that was a wrong move. Apologies. I don't know what's going on with that. Uh, I, I am a Cardigan Ramshackle, blacksmith extraordinaire. Oh, well, you're a blacksmith. That's very helpful. Oh, My yes. My husband, he's one of the guards, so he'll be needing your services quite frequently, I think. Oh, very good. Yeah, I got a pretty good uh, deal going on with all, right, all the all the guards and everything. Uh, they get a pretty good discount. I like to help out. They keep Owner us protected and all that. Yes, they do. We just arrived um, back in town just yesterday, so he's still sleeping. He had to go on duty as soon as we arrived. Oh, that's understandable. What is it that you do, Miss Cara? I'm a doctor. Oh, very good. I imagine that's pretty uh, sought-after profession around here. A lot of dangerous stuff outside the city. I got a firework. Where there I got is. Skin. Which is why I'm, I'm trying to get established as fast as I can so I can be as helpful as I can to everyone. Oh, very good. Well, you, you let Cardigan know if there's anything he can do to help you get started and get established. Thank you. I appreciate that. Most definitely. I like to help people out. I like to see the city succeed. That's that's most Come important to me. He's gonna kill stuff. Comes Abe. Everything's gonna die. Yes. Here comes Abe. Everything's I gonna die. I am confused though. I'm supposed to be able to make a chemistry bench. Hello, my name is the Abe. materials I need to make it, some of them I've never heard of before, so I don't know where to find them. Oh, perhaps I can help. Do you, do you know what these materials are called? Oh, 
Well, some of them are pretty straightforward. Um, I, let's see, I know Crystal, and I'm not sure where to get organic polymer from, but it also asks for silver ingots, and I don't know of any silver mines around here. Oh, yeah, that silver's quite rare, but I do have a connection. Oh, although that's some gun. He's asleep right now, but I, I do have access to silver ingots. Oh, all right. Well, I only need three of them, so I hope they won't be too expensive. And I do have some... Oh, that's right. I do have some metal that I need melted down, but I'm unable to do so. Oh, yes, I, I, I usually take care of that for people. Uh, I, I got a pretty good deal going on with most people. I just charge 15% and uh, everything else is yours to keep. Oh, that seems very reasonable. Where is your shop located? Oh, well, if you come out here, you go straight down that way and then there's like a big walkway that goes up to the House of Justice. Uh, I'm the second house on the left. It, it, there's a big sign and there's some trees in there and it says, uh, Cardigan Ramshackle, Blacksmith Extraordinaire. Get all your one-stop shop for Blacksmith and Needs. Something like that. Oh, that's wonderful. Yeah, you go ahead and stop by any time. Uh, if I'm not awake or something, you can go ahead and leave me a note and, I, and, and some, with some directions on how I can contact you or perhaps like put a, put a box out with like a pin code or something. I don't know. We'll figure something out. But I'm more than happy to help you. And if it's just a few ingots you need, I, I, I usually just do that as like a pro bono. Well, I think to make the bench, let me look again. I think it was 50. 50 or 15. Oh, I'll need 40 metal ingots and three silver ingots. I have the raw metal from gathering stone myself for my spark powder, but I do not have the knowledge in which to melt it down. Yes, yes, like I can definitely handle that. Right oh, well. Oh. <laughs> but are any of them extraordinary? Because I am a blacksmith extraordinaire. So the Lord of the Smiths is having a meeting right now at the courthouse, I believe. Oh, nobody told me. Oh, you better hurry there, <laughs> he, Mr. Cardigan. He gathered, he gathered the other ones that were here, so. Oh, I should probably go. All right, Miss Cora, it was a pleasure to meet you. And uh, once you need some assistance, I'll be more than happy to help you out. Thank you. I appreciate that. Most definitely. I got to grab some money. I got to buy myself one of them fancy beds. Uh, thank you, mi oh, Mr. Snook, uh, for for the information. Yep. I do appreciate that. No problem. Scissors sell uh, metal ingots or another thing that are in high demand. You can set whatever price it is that you like. Get creative. Speak with people, work out some type of deal if you like. You'd be amazed at all the things that you can do. If you apply The yourself. butter system is not frowned upon. Oh no, not at all, not at all. The only thing is that with the metal tools, that's the only thing I ask. If I hear that one of you is giving out metal tools for free or something like that to anyone who is not a hunter, there's going to be a problem. And it's just for the sake of the economy of Bastion, because if the entire economy crashes, we all lose. Oh, you only know the half of it. Yes. There was a situation like this in the past. This is something that I personally am trying <laughs> to Stuck in there. Are there any other questions? Yes, my lord. Oh, please, call me Hemlock. I come from a family. I grew up in a caravan that traveled the world. I've dedicated myself to the art of shaping up. Would it be frowned upon if I delegated good? With my fingers, I traded various goods. I wouldn't craft them, of course, but buying bows and knives. 
forgive me. It might have been my ears. Could you just repeat just that last part again? And I do apologize. <laughs> Gosh, Hemlock's voice is so amazing. Cold train. Other Korean. You frowned upon if I bought low and sold high with other. Okay, do you mean that if you purchased other things from other people and then sold those things on your table? Like, do you mean like resources or tailoring things and then you say sell I tailored buy, stuff? Say buy a set of clothing from a tailor. Selling yes. it at a premium because they got so many they're selling the low on sale. Would it be frowned upon if I waited for the market to equalize a bit and sold, resold them for a higher price? Right, the tailoring things. Well, I think it might be a little strange if, you know, you go to a blacksmith and he's selling you cotton pants. You know what I mean? <laughs> well, um... I mean, so I see I your point. If I, if I caught you selling my stuff, I'd beat you over the head with a stick. Right, <laughs> yes. I would give credit where it's due at the very least. Oh, no, of course. In fact, to be honest, I really like your thinking. You're a very, very smart man. I mean, and, and that's an <laughs> excellent, a... excellent I, I, question. I'm sorry, I cut you off. Oh, no, 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 you're fine. I, I was just simply saying that I appreciate the question. I appreciate your thinking. I just think that as Smiths, we need to stick to being a Smith as far as selling. Now, the rules of Bastion State, you only have to be a blacksmith for about half the time, right? So, though we are all brothers of steel here, but you only have to be one for 50% of the time. However, when it comes to selling goods, I would expect you and ask that it would be blacksmith-type goods, right? Because you'd be surprised how quickly people need metal ingots. Scissors, even. I mean, the, the hair grows quite quickly here. Weapons, armor, everything. Trust me, there is a high, high demand out there and a very, very low supply. So to answer your question, I see what you're saying, that you would buy low and then sell it again high, but as a blacksmith, at least by trade, I would ask that you only sell blacksmith items. Now, if this is something, however, that all of you disagree, and you all band together and don't feel that that's fair, come to me about it, and we can certainly discuss it. Again, I'm your friend here. My word is not law. I want us all to work together in this, right? What he does. Make sure the tools are at 100 gold and the flak armor is around 100. All right, that's that's the only law. Okay. What about the flak armor? I'm sorry, I was a little late and I might have missed that part. Oh, no problem, my friend. Are you a smith as well? Oh, yeah, I'm Cardigan. We met before. Oh, actually, no, you, I think, actually, yeah. Oh, Cardigan, met. that's Cardigan you. Cardigan Ramshackle, uh, blacksmith extraordinaire. Nice to meet you all. Yes. Oh, this is excellent. Oh, my goodness. This is such a fortuitous night. This is amazing. I'm so glad you're here, actually, Cardi. All right, so, Cardigan, this is incredible. There are an incredible amount of blacksmiths that just arrived on the boat. It's wonderful. Now, for all of you out there, this is Cardigan. Cardigan is an excellent, excellent smith. He's been doing a phenomenal job. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> so much. In fact, I'm actually going to be placing... In fact, I don't even know if you know this yet. I spoke to uh, Pud about this, but not you directly, so why not, right? When in Bastion, as they say. I have to leave Bastion for about three days. I will be putting Cardigan in charge in my steed for about oh three my. days. Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> why not announce it in front of everyone, right? Well, f first off, th this meeting was, was a surprise to me, but now that's even a bigger surprise. Well, I do appreciate the right. vote of confidence, your lordship. Of course. Uh, please, just call me Hemlock. You've been doing an incredible job. This is something you've earned, Cardigan. You've been doing an amazing job. Um, I left you some notes, too. Um, basically, what I was saying about is the tools at 100 gold and the flak armor. We want to keep the flak armor around the 100 gold price per piece. And the reason per is piece, we want to keep it high so that... Yes, I know it's quite high, but it is some of the most protective armor in all the land. We want to make sure that the tailors also get a bit of business. Because if everyone can afford flak, then everyone will wear flak, and the tailors will have no business, no work. Just like we're trying to help the hunters, we're trying to help the tailors as well. And in turn, they will help us. And that's how an economy grows. All right, that sounds good to me. I'm going to have to go do some adjustments on my boxing scene, though. <laughs> 
<laughs> so it's no problem. I left you uh, some detailed notes about this as well. I'm actually glad that you're here. So now again, this is Cardigan. He will be in charge of all of you uh, for just a few days here. So any questions, any problems, direct them please to Cardigan. His uh, shop is actually not far. It's actually just right here at the courthouse on the right-hand side. Um, I will be up for quite some time this evening, so you can, of course, come to me with any questions. But just remember that uh, the, the Lord's role here, as far as a blacksmith, is to be your friend to help you, not to compete against you. I want all of us to succeed. If someone is, you know, one of you is not getting the business that you like, let me know. Perhaps I can send some people your way and vice versa. I want us all to grow together. Any other questions? Yeah. Just where may we find your house or wherever your mailbox is? Ah, yes, yes. Excellent question. Excellent. Um, directly this way, um, if I could somehow run through this wall um, towards the back of the town, you'll see kind of a ramp that goes up, and that leads to the Lord's Quarter. I am the, oh, I think it's the second house on the right-hand side, but... Basically, you'll see my mailbox right when you go I up the ramp, was wrong about on the road that. on the right hand side. <laughs> the second little open, you'll see uh, see my mailbox there. Please leave me a, a message or a note. But for the next three days or so, uh, please send those messages to Cardigan, um, and he should be able to help you out. But if there's anything tonight, or if any of you want to speak privately after this, we can certainly do that. And we'll also take a walk over to uh, Car Cardigan's shop as well. And you can see his mailbox. So if there's any uh, questions, you can uh, leave them there. Any other questions? Yes. Uh, where might you suggest that the greener blacksmith start? Well, I mean, to get things rolling, um, you want to uh, first make a uh, forge, um, kind of like a, a way just to kind of melt the metal. Now, you'll notice around town, I need to speak with the guards. I haven't spoken to the guards yet about this. But you'll notice there's some river rocks around town, quite a few of them. And it's actually an excellent way to get some starter metal before you head on out there in search of the big stuff, right? So go around town and you can mine the little river rocks. Now, I don't know if the guards have a problem with this. I know they have an issue with the trees. Don't cut down the king's trees. I know that's bad. Don't cut down my but trees either. Rock. That pisses me off. Right, yeah, I would just avoid all trees <laughs> in the city of Bastion if you can. But you'll notice throughout the entire city there are these river rocks. And if you hit it, even with a uh, primitive tool, uh, with a pick, you can get quite a bit of metal. And it adds up uh, rather quickly. I, I, can, uh, I can inform you that the, uh, yeah, the trees, they, uh, apparently some of them don't come back, but the rocks do. It should be fine. Excellent. To, to mine. They do come back. Good, 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 good. And I'll try and find out if, if the guards or somebody has a problem with this. And if they do, I'm going to convince them. Looks like everybody's prices of gear is going up. For those of us just <laughs> getting started out, it's, it's an excellent way to get some metal uh, just to kind of get the ball rolling. All right, so to answer your question, I would start with a kind of a forge, get some starter metal, build that forge uh, so you can melt it into some ingots, maybe then get a bastion smithy going. And then you can start crafting your own tools. And if you smiths want to work with a hunter to find out where some of the resources are out there or work with each other, that's that's up to you. If you want to pair up and help find where the metal might be or the gold or the mithril or the fire star. I mean, my goodness, there's so many resources out there. It's unbelievable. I would also recommend also making a pike to possibly protect yourself as well because farther out you go, the more dangerous it is. Also, make sure you have a heater with you and a torch. Torch is very important and also a bit of food as well. Any other questions? No. Will we all be part of a tribe? Well, I don't know, actually. I think that's probably up to you guys. I didn't know if that's something that you wanted to do, if you wanted to have our own smithy tribe or... Just join the tribe here in Bastion. I mean, I, I'll leave that up to you. A Smithy's Guild of some sorts, maybe. 
There could be yeah, some kind of idea, alliance actually. or something that that might work as well. Oh, excellent, Cardigan. Yes, yes. We definitely could do that. Any other questions? Well, all right. Well, this is exciting. We've got some Smiths here in Bastion. <laughs> yes, very excited about this. We're all going to do great. And please, if there's any questions whatsoever, please let me know. Any problems, anything you like, dislike, this is all the discussion. And again, we'll be uh, speaking with Cardigan here for the next few days. He'll be in charge. He's an excellent, excellent smith. Very knowledgeable as well. He should be able to help you out with anything you need. And uh, Cardigan, sorry for the sudden surprise. Oh, no worries, no <laughs> worries. I'm pretty excited about this too because maybe I can get some sleep every once in a while now. <laughs> yes, exactly. This poor man here has been supplying pretty much the entire city of Bastion, so... Yeah, I've done ran Got out of the city here. and he gets so many dang times. That's right, that's right. Excellent. Well, I would call this meeting adjourned. Um, if you'd like, maybe we could all just take a quick uh, tour over to Cardigan's shop real quick. Just to take a quick glance so we know where that is. So if you have any questions for the next few days, you can drop it off at his uh, mailbox there. I'm afraid to ask for help. You need some help. Here we are. What was that? Here it is. So see, just right next to the courthouse here, you'll see his mailbox. And um, there's also a uh, there's a market nearby, and uh, I encourage you guys to actually set up your tables at the market as well. You can either place it in front of your home, like Cardigan has done here, or you can place it at the market. Do you know where the market is? I do not. Can we place it in both? Yes, you can place it in both. And if, let's go to the market. I'll show you right oh. where that is. Hello. Oh, hello, my friend. <laughs> Welcome. Emma. You oh, look like hey, you need I'm, some I'm a bit lost. I do. I need some clothes. Whoa. Thanks. Hello. Well. Um, I'm a little lost. My name is uh, Gavin. I'm here hoping to get a guard position in the wonderful city of Bastion here. Oh, wonderful. That's excellent. Well, we are the blacksmiths of Bastion. Oh, I'm not sorry. Sorry, I'm not. There's many others as well. There's <laughs> the Sophie's majority important. of us here are uh, Smiths here. This, I'm just so excited. There's so many Smiths now. It's Am just, I allowed oh. to send around here? Yes, yes, it's Can fine, Sophie. Okay. Th this is Sophie. She's a hunter. You're you alarmed. might want to make connection I'm with her. She'll be Am very. Am I not wearing valuable. pants? No, no sir, you are not I wearing pants. I'll, I'll get it. Wait a second. Yeah, all right. I will forgive. Give me Gavin. Let me. Um, I'm just gonna take the uh, Smith sure here. I was just a quick... pants already. We're gonna take the Smith. Oh, it's quite alright. There's another guard, I believe, right here with you. Oh, is there? Do, do you know where I uh, I could find him? Well, you actually both new guards here. So. Yes. Yes. All right. Well, Smith, come with me real quick. In fact, you're welcome to come as well. Actually. Um, all of you, because this Field is good. We're going to show where the, where the market is. Oh, I really appreciate that. Of course, it's good to have you here. All right, we're just going to go straight here, back to the bank, right? We're all familiar where the bank is, yes? <laughs> Look at all these it's people. It's very <laughs> easy to get lost here in Bastion, and it will be a little frustrating at times, but don't worry. It'll come around. All right. So here's the bank. This is where most of you first showed up when you arrived here in Bastion. In fact, for those that are brand new, make sure you go inside, speak with the banker there, and you can get your 200 gold coins to start. So if you haven't gotten that yet, you want to make sure you go ahead and do that? <laughs> most of them are. First, let, me, uh, let me show you where the market is. What's going on, Chris? Come back here and get the uh, gold coin started. Welcome back, buddy. All right, so right over here to the right, Notice Rondark's little uh, bar here that just started, get going. Just go straight, and boom. Here we are, the market. This is... Just like that. Uh, 
are still in the process oh. of getting built. Again, this is kind of the first day that the boat has arrived. But this is a place where you can feel free to place your tables. You can either place them in front of uh, your home or place them here. Now let's see. Do they have anything for Smiths here? This, this side. One over here Basically. Oh, nice, man. Good luck. <laughs> Let me know if you need any help. I'll do my best. Area. Perhaps, Cardigan, what do you think? Where, where could we set up uh, maybe a little thing of some Smith tables or something? I mean, maybe over here by the Fletcher stuff. Or perhaps we get a builder to expand this place a bit, because we're quite magnificent. We need lots of room. New citizens today has been great. Oh, Mr. Hammer. There's so much people here. Right here. Yes. Voice sounds familiar yes. to me. And if any of you need clothes, yes, I live over it's here. Cora. Wait, Cora. Did... <laughs> close? Oh, it's good to see you. Well, How are you? I'm a tailor. <gasps> well, just um, you are self-established here. <laughs> just oh, arrived that's yesterday. Yes, I am. I'm, oh, that's I'm wonderful! So welcome, welcome, welcome. Give me just like fifteen. Where the hell this big piece of go? Oh, no, <laughs> big piece of poop come from? Oh, that horse over there! Really Can't believe it. Oh, this is wonderful. All right, Smiths. So this is the market area here. So feel free to place a table somewhere around here if you like. And also in front of your home as well. But this is kind of a nice I central meeting yes, area where people can place their tables okay. and sell back. their wares. I'll, I'll Save it. <laughs> I have a ton. Uh, just go to this. You All need right. to put a bunch of. You know uh, the prices? We discussed them earlier. Um, compost bins in the stables. Good to go. And again, for the next three days, Cardigan <coughs> here will be in charge. Send any questions over to Cardigan. Myself, I'm straight that way up in the Lord's Quarter. I think it's the second house on the right, but you'll see my mailbox on the road, actually. So, any questions whatsoever, <laughs> feel free to drop by. And I think we should be good. I have a any question. Other? Yes. I totally forgot what I'm I I'm not thinking. a blacksmith, though. Am I allowed to ask something? Of course. Sorta, I broke nearly my tools, and I'm actually in sort of blacksmith heaven right now. Is there anyone who could help me fix my tools? Oh, Sophie, you know you get <laughs> free repairs. You can bring them right over to my spot. Uh, but if anybody else is set up, it might, might hook them up, too. Oh, my. I'm so happy. Thank you. <laughs> that's, <is. laughs> now, see, that's something where Cardigan has set up a deal with Sophie there. And something that you can do as well. Now, is Sophie a hunter? Yes, yeah, she's a hunter. That's why she gets free repairs. That's wonderful. It's exactly right. So you see what he did there? You can establish relationships with hunters. You can work together. You know what I mean? It's kind of a good thing. It encourages you to speak to other people and kind of find your own way, but, but you can do it together. That's the key. Yeah, I got to spread that, spread that coin around quite a bit. Everybody needs a piece of the pie. That's right. As long as we want to keep those hunters in business, hunters will keep us in business keep the tailors in business everyone stays in business everyone's happy and we all succeed in theory that's hopefully how it will work it could all crash by next week but for now let's keep <laughs> 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 all right. i guess that concludes if there's any other questions i guess that includes uh concludes the meeting there smith i'm so Hi. happy to have you here my lord i'm i'm a tailor and uh I haven't seen the Lord of Taylors yet, so I don't know if my prices are good. All right, no problem. I will look into that. I will speak to the other Lords. Got my stream set up, my next is Cam, Taylors, yeah. and maybe a mic. But we now, probably need a mic if we're going to be the streaming. Lord of the Taylors, just set your prices, do your thing. I mean, we are kind of similar, the Smiths and the Taylors, and that we try to armor and protect our citizens of Bastion, so. If you like, if you need some guidance, you can speak with um, Cardigan here. He's going to be in charge of the Smiths for the next few days. And uh, maybe you could work something out. We're trying to set our prices high on the flak armor because it offers some of the most protection. So if your tailoring prices wish to be maybe a bit lower, that might help you with your sales as well. But we want to keep our flak prices high. So that you, as a tailor, also get some business. Because what we don't People got want hooked is up by me then. Black armor and run around, and uh, there's no business for the tailors. You see, 
Seems fun. Okay, Excellent. My lord. <laughs> Do you think that I should wait until the commander wakes up or work out something with one of these gentlemen about getting some god armor? Well, I actually have some made up because the Lord of the Guards, uh, well, he pressured me into it, but he, he, he'll he take care of your tab, I imagine, after after he wakes up. Oh, perfect. Then there you go. Nice. I've got some as well, too, but if you've got some ready, Cardigan, then that's wonderful. Yes, then you can get your armor from, uh, from Cardigan here. Very well. Thank you. Um, I have a, sim a kind of similar question. Um, if I wish to, I guess, you know, be with the guard, do I need to talk to the guard commander first? Well, did, was that your kind of chosen profession, as it were, when you entered Bastion? Uh, yes, yes, it was, Lord. Oh, excellent. Then you should be good to go. Please, please call me Hemlock. Um, it, there is a time where you will want to meet up with your with your lord, the commander of the guard. He's quite the character, by the way. I wish you luck. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> uh, yes. okay. but we will. We can provide you uh, with some guard armor here. In fact, uh, the armor that we can make as smiths, we actually have specific guard armor that is separate <clears throat> from flak or anything else that you'll find. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you, Lord Hemlock. <laughs> Just Hemlock, my friend. Thank you, though. <laughs> Any other questions? It is not Hemcock. <laughs> Boy, look at all these wonderful citizens of Bastion. Yeah, That's this is wonderful. quite fun. This place was getting kind of lonely for a while. I felt I felt like it was never going to happen, but this is beautiful. This is definitely beautiful. I've been sleeping for quite some time because, you know, I can be very dizzy in my head sometimes. I wake up to see all you people. That is wonderful. Yes, indeed. That was quite wonderful. I feel like there's more people in now. one spot like, than I've ever seen in Bastion. <laughs> some of us who have been up for long enough saw an, an earlier group of folks just as big, and now this group, so it's going to be quite, quite busy around here. I like it. <laughs> They, yes, you ought to know I'm the best hunter in town, you know? Okay, I'm really bad at lying. I'm quite the worst one, I guess. That's fine. <laughs> well, at least you're awake. I think the only other hunter I've seen awake, well, since the first few days, was Mr. Pudwhacker. Uh, otherwise, we had an influx oh, yeah. of them, but now now I haven't seen one for days. So I was uh, awake earlier today. Yes, the new boat arrived. Plenty of people here, so this is wonderful. So, are you all blacksmiths? I am. Yeah, I think. Can't speak for you. Yeah, I am. I think there's a couple That's guards a and, and the father over there, but for the most part, it looks like there are a bunch of nice blacksmiths around here. Oh, and a tailor, okay, excuse me, apologies. Looks like you have a, a good big group of people. Out. Cora there? Over there is a doctor, I believe, yes? Yes, yes I am. <laughs> oh, oh, great! Oh yes, we got quite a good influx of doctors today as well. Hello, Cora. I think we're neighbors. My name's Lance. Oh, hello, Lance. It's nice to meet you. So, if you have no other business, I have a few things I have to attend to. Of course, of course. Pleasure. Thank you. Welcome. All right, everyone. I guess that concludes this evening. Any other questions? You can see myself or Cardigan, actually. In fact, probably Cardigan would be better since he'll be in charge the next few days there. He's going to be doing an excellent job. He's a great smith. Very, very knowledgeable. Very kind. <laughs> yeah. I do try. I do try. Let's well, give than you most. two guards here some more <laughs> as well, eh? <laughs> Think Corinthian. Oh, yeah. Hi, Would you fix my things, maybe? Bye. If you're done. Take care. Oh, my God. All right. Well, let me see here. I think I've got a couple of sets, Cardigan, of guards' armor back at my, uh, my forge. How many do you have on you? 
Oh well, back at my at my uh, blacksmithing, yeah. uh, I got I think three right oh, now. Is that you, Mr. Sagging Ten? Oh, ready to go. All right. Oh, that's Lovely great. to see you, you again. Just do that there. Thank you, thank you. I yep, yep. Uh, is there anything else oh, you need of me, uh, your lordship, uh, Mr. Hamlock? Today. He's sleeping. Though. <laughs> they, they put him to oh, work. You're going to be as taking on quite a bit of responsibility. Thank you again for accepting. Um, Accepting this uh, leadership duty, and uh, thank you again for all your hard work. You've been incredible, Smith. Thank you. Oh well, thank you. You do flatter me. I got it. You my friend. I was just asking if you were still. In all right, so Sophie. Uh, if you want to follow me and those two guards, right? If you guys want to come over there, I can get you guys fitted up right quick. Only if you have time yes, for it. Very well. Oh, of course, of course. <laughs> really appreciate All it. Have a bed. All right, everybody, you got any questions day. or anything? You go ahead and come see me. So you're the other guard uh, he was talking about? Oh, hello there, Mr. Joshua. How you doing? Hello, how are you? I'm fine. That's fantastic. Fantastic. Good to see you again. And do you do? I love your pet. Oh my god, what's his name? Oh, this is Ingot. He, he, he's he got some uh, gold fever. This little guy loves to pick up little gold pieces off the ground. Oh. Oh my god, he's beautiful. Yep, yep, uh, the Lord of the, I believe it's Lord Silver, he, he got it for me because I did him a bunch of favors. Uh, fantastic. Yeah, you got to see yourself one of them stable masters. I believe they even have a, a couple of vultures now, which is quite fine, but I couldn't give up Ingot here for nothing. They're doing all really well, huh? Thanks, storm kicking up. Was there something you need, Mr. Joshua? You look like you were looking for something when I came over here. Uh, no, I'm just, uh, just making up you now. Oh, excellent, excellent. All right, well, you stop by if you got any blacksmithing needs. I'm blacksmith extraordinaire here. Uh, I'm going to get these two oh, fellas uh, worked out. Fine. And Miss Sophie, if you want to follow me into the waiting room. Yes, I have to get something, though. Is it okay if I join your waiting room in a second? Oh, of course, of course. I'll be here. Sorry, fellas. I think I missed your names. Uh, I'm Alistair Wilson. It's nice to meet you. Oh, pleasure's all mine. And mine is Gavin. Gavin, so Alistar and, and Gavin. It's a pleasure to meet you. It's always nice to have a couple more guards keeping the city nice and safe. I was uh, about oh, to course. think that more after the city was filled with nothing but uh, blacksmiths for a minute. Oh yes, I mean it, it's crazy out there. I, I didn't, I didn't, wasn't even told about the, the meeting, but uh, I'm glad I made it so I could get my well, my leadership role. I guess I've never been much of a leader, but I'm more than happy to help out. Uh, yeah, but there's a lot of people in this town now. I met a bunch of hunters and a bunch of stable masters, and even a few tailors. It's it's pretty nice now, and there's quite a few guards actually. They went on an expedition today, and there was like five or six of them just like in this tiny little room waiting for gear. <laughs> That's yeah. great. I'm gonna have to expand that waiting room. <laughs> Maybe put some chairs goes? down. Oh, yes. I've been so dang busy because I've been the only blacksmith for so long that I ain't had no chance to uh, to decorate my house or nothing like that. So uh, hopefully with all these other guys taking some, some of the work off my hands, uh, I'll be able to get a little more fancy in here. Oh, I wanted to ask a question as well. Oh, uh, of with course. The, uh, on me. Guard, with a guard armor, is there uh, such thing as a guard sword or is it just a regular sword? Oh no, it's a regular sword. I do believe there's gonna be some uh, some fancier swords coming in the future, but at, at the moment, all I can do is a regular sword. And actually, that doesn't come with the price of the armor. And swords are damn expensive. You might want to start off with a pike, 
But I do give the guards a discount hey. on, on the weaponry compared to the normal citizens of this here fine city. It's good well. to know. I'll make sure to drop by here for all my needs. Oh, most definitely. I mean, I'm sure there's going to be some more fine uh, blacksmiths, but I'm probably the most well-established one at the moment. So you can go ahead and stop by anytime. I'll, I'll work you out. Boots, helmets, legs, chest, and gauntlets. I believe I heard uh, Lord Helmlock talking about this, uh, what was it, Mithril Armor. How does that compare with others? Oh, you know, I, I haven't made any of that yet. I, I'm Actually, that's what I need to talk to him about. Dang it, I totally forgot. I'm going to go find him in a minute, but I'll get you guys sorted out first. Here, I'm going to stick you guys' armor in this here box. And then, uh, if you guys want a pike, that's 30 coin. This will put on your tab until you get it sorted out with your lord. If you each want to take one of each of those. The guard armor is going for 250 coin, but I highly doubt you have that right now. I do believe the lord takes care of that. You must be one rich fella. Oh, I, I've Ooh, made buddy. a pretty good coin, especially because I've been the only one, but oh. I've been run ragged. I would take a little less money just to get some damn sleep sometimes. <laughs> All right. So, did you guys want a, a pike? Oh, who is that? Oh, uh, did you? Did, oh, this is beautiful. <laughs> I don't think we met, but I, I'll be more than happy to discuss uh, anything with you right after I get these people, find people in here settled up. Uh, I like the lighting in the lighting. I know it's beautiful. Ah. The only other thing I was going to ask about the armor is uh, Helmlock was talking about a shield as well. Uh, does that come with, or do we need to buy that? Oh, I imagine your lord will take care of that as well, but the sword, the shields are damn expensive right now. I'm trying to work out a good resource on obsidian, a good connection. As soon as I have that, you guys will be the first to know, and I'll have swords for all the guards, that's for sure. Or, I mean, shields. I can get you all the obsidian you want. Oh, I need I all the obsidian you have. That. Uh, yeah, I have a nice I have place. Do, do, or now or something. do you know where to find the actual rocks? Like a big rock of it so you no, can break it down? No, that is not what I know. Yeah, yeah, I, I think I know what you're uh, talking about, but I'll be more than happy to buy that obsidian off you, that's for sure. If uh, if you uh, really want to, well, since uh, I, I don't think I caught your name, uh, you said it earlier, but uh, I was halfway down. There's so Gavin, I, I believe. Gavin, all right. Gavin, yeah, it's Gavin. Gavin, Gavin, Gavin. Gavin, Gavin. All right. I have to say it multiple times. Hopefully, I remember. See you later, bro. I'm going to try to figure things out. All right. Have a great so Gavin. Thanks, buddy. So, the thing that I was thinking is if you're trying to find a specific location for this obsidian, after everybody gets suited up and well, we could, uh, if you want, Gavin and I could probably go out with you, protect you, and uh, we can find some resources to you know, help you, uh, each other about. Oh, that'd be something you have to work out with the hunters. I usually like to give them my business. I don't like to go out on my own all that much, only when they're asleep. I'm, but I'm sure Sophie here would, would like to work something out with you guys. Well, uh, sorry. Yeah, I, I was, I was talking to her. Oh, okay. Oh, did you two want a pie? <laughs> sorry. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to have to go get my gold first. Oh, no worries. I'll, give, I'll get you the pikes now, and you can just transfer the money into my account if you like. Uh, you can do that? Uh, yep, I don't know bank, how to do you, that. At the bank, you talk to the banker, and you'd be like, you just think about transferring, and she, she'll, she'll handle the rest. My name is Cardigan Ramshackle. You just you just tell her that, and then you can transfer as much money as you want. So the pikes right. are going to be 30 gold apiece, though. You do get a discount on, on, on repairs, and that's 20 gold discount in general anyways. But, uh, yeah, you get a discount on repairs because you were part of the guard. Stick them in this here box. So, the only thing you two owe me tonight is is thirty gold a piece. You can go ahead and transfer transfer into my account, or you can bring it back if you don't like to handle that fandangled uh, banker lady. 
whatever whatever floats your boat tickles your fancy or whatever all right okay. the only the only other thing that i was gonna ask is uh scissors because uh th this isn't caught it for me i don't like what's going up top oh yes i, I do have scissors for sale uh they're about 15 gold a piece all right very well i was doing uh, uh free repairs but with the how scarce the obsidian is i might have to start charging people for the repairs but it won't be much it's like a gold, a gold piece or two maybe that's not too bad it depends on how how fast they break and everything you guys can give me some feedback and we'll, we can we can discuss prices but uh did you need a pair right uh, now um yeah i was gonna just try to cut it so let's see here we got cutting gavin uh, miss, what is your name again? I'm sorry. Oh, hi. I'm Sophie. Sophie, 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 Sophie. All right. Um, but yeah, uh, what I was talking about earlier, it was mainly towards you. If you do want to go out at any point in time, just, uh, ask me. I'd be more than welcome to go out. All right, Thank Mr. Alistair. So I will very much remember that. Th those scissors but are But I don't know, like, where the, where the small little obsidian rubber not really the total big one so if i find out i really want to ha uh, have some help of course yes thank you oh well, you're very welcome oh you, you said it was in here house? yep scissors uh yeah side. i do I just haven't done anything with it that'll well, be 45 gold total right before you then all right all right well, i'm gonna back up here so i don't call anybody else all right and now miss sophia you needed some repairs done oh, yeah. Yes, please. And I also would like to ask, could you make my iron into a bar? So what do I do for that? Your what into what? Sorry, I missed that. Oh, I'm sorry. My metal. Oh, you want my ore? Could or you, you want it metal ingots? My yeah. Oh, I can definitely do that. I charge 15% off the top, but never the rest is yours. Okay. All right, everybody seems to be pretty happy with that deal. Uh, do you got some tools all for right, me? I'm gonna go uh, do the yes, gold I'll, real I'll quick. Drop, I'll drop it all here, yeah? Yeah, probably yeah, the that's same. Fine. Mm -hmm. I kinda uh, wanna Mr. See Lance, the bank works. if you wanna come in now, you can discuss some stuff here, unless unless you want some privacy, uh, and so I can wait until Sophie's done here. Okay. Also, uh, should I drop my metal too? Uh, just, yeah, you could drop your metal. I, I'll put that in, in the smelter it's, right now. It's quite a bit, so. How much you got? Like 200 something. Oh, yeah, that last one's pretty heavy. Oh, hold on. Give me a second. I'll be right back. <laughs> Hello, Sophie. I'm Lance. Very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Lance. Well, you know, I'm Sophie. <laughs> so, what did your job? Hmm? I'm a blacksmith as well. I see. So that'd be 114 <laughs> ingots total. Um, what's 15% of that? Hold on, I gotta do some math. I'm not the best at this. Me neither. <laughs> but I trust you. Oh yeah, I would never. I'd never try to rip no one off. I mean, we're all in this together, I know. right? That's what I'm saying. I trust right. you, too. Where's my freaking calculator? So, Len, there for how is. long are you here yet? Did you arrive today? Just arrived maybe a few hours oh. ago. Nice. Very impressive place. I know, right? All right, I'll just be taking 17 ingots off the top, so you get yourself, uh, let's see. 14 minus 17. I can't do math right now. I'll get you 97 ingots um, back. Oh, thank you. Uh, I've been here quite some time now. Actually, forgot how long. A little later than land. Sort of. But I still feel quite hard as if hunted at <laughs> all. Time. I seem to be in a bit of a predicament. You wouldn't happen to have any hide, would you? Uh, I have, I'll, but I have to get it from my house, so I'll be back. 
Okay, that would be fantastic. That will get them repairs done. I'll give you an even hundred after that. I just that. have a few qu questions. Oh, yes, lay them on me, Mr. Lance. Since you are a veteran and I don't want to step on toes, I'm not familiar with what I should be charging for certain things like ingots. And I heard the other, some of the other, and I've heard the 15%. I, I hope you don't mind if I stick with that so we match. Oh, no, that's fine. That's fine. There's going to be plenty of hunters around that are going to need themselves some ingots and stuff. I imagine that'd be good. The 15% I thought was a pretty fair deal. And what would you charge per ingot? Okay, so uh, that I'm still working out, but at the moment I'm charging, well, for regular people, I charge <clears throat> one gold for two ingots. Okay. <clears throat> I usually buy um, uh, st stacks of 200 uh, raw metal off of the hunters for about 25 gold. I may be raising that soon, though, especially because the price of flak has gone up so much. I may be giving them a better deal in the future. Uh, I'm going to have to work on that. I, I'll know a little bit more by tomorrow, most likely, but I think that's a pretty good deal just to start, depending on how they get it. Indeed. As far as swords, I, I sell this. Oh, no, no. Uh, it's good that we're all on the same page. Uh, for the swords, I charge quite a pretty penny because they're quite expensive. I usually charge about 150 for the swords and if if a guard comes to me i give him a good deal and give it to him for 100. you got that uh hide miss sophie yeah i don't know how much you want it so i brought quite a bit thank you for answering i'm gonna leave you to your business and um if i have any other questions do you mind if i come by and ask oh no 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 worries at all uh, as uh, the lord said i guess i'm in charge now and if you have any questions feel free to stop by if i'm not awake you can go ahead and leave me a note and i'll get back to you as soon as possible good eve good evening Hi, mr lance all right sophie i'm gonna get your your ingots rolling right now is there is there some ingots you need right this second because it's gonna take a little bit for oh, them to no. get smelted down no no take your turn all right, I'll have him. I'll have him to you before I go to bed. That's for sure. Thank you. And I'll give you an even hundred sure. since you brought me some of this hide. Ooh. Hey, Carl, oh, Harold, we just had a question for you. Sorry. Right. Yeah. Oh yes, Father Harold. It's good to see you again. What What was the question? Oh yes, we were interested in seeing how much you would. Uh, sell or if you had any silver ingots available okay about silver ingots i do believe uh, miss coral was looking for them um, i'm gonna see if i can get into this box that my, my my friend mo has he has some resources and i'm i'm trying to get that together so we can get some silver uh, rolling um i should know a little bit more in like the next half an hour or so oh all right yes that's that's me and coral are wondering because we're trying to see if we can pull our resources get us a chemistry bench going so we can start making the proper medicines oh yes that's fantastic i look forward to trying some of that medicine but uh yeah i just gotta make get, get a hold of mo real quick he he had some uh resources for me the dang silver so hard to find though so uh we'll, we'll, we'll figure out something nice though i imagine you guys uh Need, need need a pretty good deal being doctors and all and you guys are helping everyone so i i, I imagine we work something out Oh, okay. Well, thank you. I just wanted to ask that. Most definitely. Uh, do let us know. Uh, I will come and find you, uh, Father and, and Miss Cora. A pleasure to see you again. Thank you. You as well. All right. Have a good night, Cardigan. Oh, and you as well. Do let me know if I can help in any other way. Yes, certainly. All right, so I'm all set except for Kite then. All right, Miss Sophie. Yeah. I got your your tools here, and uh, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And I, it is free repairs, but we do like to take a little donation sometimes for the ore, just just to get to, to kind of cover the cost. But otherwise, I mean, we're good now. I got my fifteen percent, and I'll I'll have them other ingots up for you tonight. And narcotics. Thank you so much. Also, I checked. I have like a three hundred and twenty-five obsidian at the moment. Oh, very nice. I'm gonna need so all of that. Um, let me let me see how much how much I can give you for it. I usually just eat that, you know, I'm uh, new in this, so I've actually no clue how much to ask. So if you seem yeah, to so have I a good reasonable price, I'm, I'm willing to take it. 
Oh, all right, all right. Well, it's a bit more rare than the ore, so I'm gonna give you a premium on it over the ore. That's for sure. Uh, how how high do they stack? Uh, in hundreds. In hundreds. All right, all right. I live right behind the hospital. If you ever need to find me. Oh yes, yes. Of course, I'm right across from the church, or in the church itself sometimes. Oh, wonderful. So I'm going to get back to my <coughs> and um, I guess we'll see about that silver in about half an hour or so then. I can, how about, how, how does 50, 50 coin for 100 stack sound? Is that is that too low, too high? What, what's going on here? Um. Do, do you want some more? I can, I can go with. I can possibly go as high as seventy-five. I think so because I know that Pud was selling like seventy-five. Yeah, that like, that guy has some or, outrageous prices. I would never buy. Any you're of right. His oh, wares. okay. <laughs> okay. Could you do uh, a, a I little? I could do high seventy-five. Is maybe does that sound better? I mean, it's almost like I'm. I'm only going to pay, I think, a, a hundred for the gold stack. So I mean, and gold's mm -hmm. quite a bit more rare. It's okay to me. I'll get them for you. All right. So three hundred and fifty, two twenty-five. Give her 250 for the whole thing of them. I don't think I'm trying to pay one gold for one <laughs> obsidian. <laughs> so I asked someone to help me carry this because it was quite. Oh, I, I was I could have come came and help you, but if you got somebody, that works oh, as well. Joshua came along, so I asked him, but uh, he seems to have rather a problem with it. Uh, oh, all right. I have no problem. So I'm not sure if you are. How, well, you, you seem to be very strong, so maybe. No, I am strong enough. I have it. I'm apparently stronger than you, sir. <laughs> All right. So you said you had 325, right? Yes. So I can give you 250 coin for all that. Does that sound good? Yeah. Oh, all right. Now, would you like me to uh, just insert that into your account, or do you want want it in in cold hard gold? Um, if you want it in your hand, nice. I can. I can just uh, no. fall. okay. I'm too scared to lose things. I'll be okay on my account. <laughs> oh, all right. Well, I'm gonna head over to the bank right now. Oh, hold on. Let me get let me get this stuff smelting real quick, and then I'm gonna head over to the bank and make that transfer. Thank you so much. Can I maybe can finally get a fur armor? <gasps> Yep, that fur is pretty nice. Pretty nice. I'll finally stop pleasing my my bum off. All right, Miss Sophie, was there anything else you needed? Thank no, thank you so much. Excellent, of and course. And also very much thank you for being so kind and helping me out. Oh, yes, yes. And if I find a way to get you guys more money for your guys' resources, please believe I will definitely do that. If oh, I can I sell know. this stuff a little higher, then I'll definitely give you guys a cut of that. Thank you. And I will very much find, try to find the obsidian. 
Yes, all I, of we got to find the big rocks or something like that because those yes. little rocks are not going to cut it, especially if we get a lot more guards in here. <clears throat> yeah. So how much obsidian would it be for one arm on this head? Um, let's see. Uh, actually, it's not even the armor that's that bad. It's the shields. I need 200, the, yeah. 200 obsidian per shield. I see. Okay. Well, I'll try to do my best. Oh, de thank you very much, Miss Sophie. I do appreciate all the hard work you do around here. Thank you, and the same is likewise to you, good sir. Excellent. You have yourself a fine day. I'll see you around. You too. <clears throat> My name is Sophie White, I believe. <laughs> How did I get <laughs> uh, such responsibility? I haven't even been here. Let's see. Transfer some money. Uh, miss. Uh, Sophie White. Look at all these names. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> the church. That's awesome, too. Sophie White. Glory Coins. 250. She thought boys had cooties. <laughs> card again. I oh, thought God. I heard you, old man. How you doing? I'm doing real good. Hey, I need. I mean, I I need to talk to you. All right. Do, do you need, need some privacy? Oh, okay. Yep. I can. What, no. Which stuff? The stuff I'm wearing. Oh, I'll you you been fighting pants, wolves again? Or... Yeah, they're all over the place out there, and I gotta take care of business and keep the farm safe. Oh, most definitely. Well, you stop by in the time in Sounds that. like you definitely need fortification. Oh, well, we got a little fence. It's pretty good. It, it keeps things relatively safe. But you don't want it too safe or it gets boring, and then, then old Abe doesn't have nothing to do. All <laughs> the youngins is running around collecting poop and getting fertilizer and doing this and doing that, and Abe just stands there watching them. I'd much rather fight the wolves. <laughs> old Abe, protector of old the farm. Abe. That's right. That's my job. That's my lordly, lordly duty to protect the people and keep them safe. I don't know why they hired an old man. They should have hired a young and I'm doing my best. I think it's because you're too ornery to die. Wisdom. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> and wisdom. You listen to this father fella. He knows what he's talking about, Cardigan. We are we're just <laughs> young. We don't get it yet. <laughs> you put the, the young ones to work, Mr. Abe. You don't need to That's be right. straining your back at all. Let them do well, all the heavy lifting. I sure will. I sure will. I'll just take care of the little business of protecting. <laughs> I appreciate it. And I'll tell them that I have doctor's orders. <laughs> That's right. That's right. <laughs> That's right. I do believe I met another farmer today. Her name is Athena. We, we escorted her out to the farm, but there was nobody awake there. Oh, so. yes. I got to meet her and uh, to set her up in a place and showed her around and told her our plans and yeah, she's a real nice lady. And then there's some other feller who moved in over there, but I haven't met and I assume he's a farmer. Otherwise, he's a damn trespasser and I'll, I'll show him. 
<laughs> there was another young lady uh, by the name of Gemma, but I'm not sure if she's made her way out there yet. Oh, yeah, oh, we got yes, her set up. Gemma. Yeah, she's doing really well, working hard right this very moment, as a matter of fact. She's awake right now? I just hope she... Yes, she is. She sure is. Actually, I had a gift for you and Gemma. Oh, thank you. Is it a new horsey? Oh, no, I can't afford it. You see them outrageous prices out there at the new market? They wanted set 450 coin for a one-year-old uh, horse. Uh, that thing's going to get eaten as soon as it steps out of Bastion. What? That's insanity. Oh. That's the dumbest thing I've you ever heard. You should have been here last night, then. You could have got him for around 100 gold. Oh, damn it. Oh, I should have been awake what? last night. Yes, there was this. there was probably six or seven horses there. They were anywhere from a hundred to hundred and twenty-five gold, and that's all they were. Well, and now I saw them and I, I wanted know they to get one, but I I couldn't figure out how to do it. Like I saw a seventeen-year-old. They were trying to sell for a thousand. Magical coin above them, but I didn't know how to purchase them. You got to go to the stall oh. and buy 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 their deed. Yeah, it was, it was a. Um, <sighs> Looks like a kind of like a trough, a, whole, a feeding trough that was in front of them. That was the. I thought it was a oh. feeding trough, son of. Thanks. Right. I understand your frustration, Cora. I'm sad that I missed out on such a deal myself. Well, we'll have to talk to Mo. I saw it. <sighs> That's why, whenever I heard everyone complaining about the prices, I was like, but they were only a hundred gold. I thought that was very reasonable. Oh, that's actually well, a little now bit that low. I know they're up to, to around 400. That's, well, for uh, that's a one year old. Story. That's a one year old. I saw a 17 year old there, and they're selling them for a thousand. Well, I was like, holy crap. I mean, I, I can, I can this, kind of afford that. If they ever want that. one carrot, they better make me a damn deal. <laughs> they ain't gonna have to yeah. be embarrassed for dang ever. <laughs> that will take them hours. <laughs> that's right. That's right. And I don't mind the wait because I'm in no hurry. But I've got carrots <laughs> by the hundreds <laughs> well, maybe you could work out a deal and trade them carrots for a good horse uh, that's what i've been planning but i still gotta meet one of them <laughs> well when mo wakes yeah, back up hopefully we make a deal with him so we all get ourselves a nice horse i oh, know i didn't meet a, a, a young a nice young uh, new stable hand i believe his name was grub and he has plans on trying to breed animals <gasps> oh my is that oh, a gerboa what is so cute. Thank you. Oh, I just got this armor. I, no, uh, <laughs> the animal. Oh, where, where, where did you where get did it? Where did you get the? Yep, yep, where, same question. Where, where, where? Uh, there's a place where I go for silk and they kind of just, you know, swarmed me. They're and adorable. this one followed me home. I want it. Want one? It's so damn cute. <laughs> uh, I believe you could ask. Uh, what's his name? Roger. He knows where they are, and uh, he can get them. Roger. Well, when my daughter arrives, I know that she intended to be a stable hand as well. So, when she finally gets here, I can maybe speak with her as well. Howdy. Hello, Mr. Hello. Hello there. Hello. Anyone, is anyone I've had, you know, that would need stone to hide? Hi, oh, you berries. Let me check. I do need to go out there and kill some critters to get myself a little, a little bit of hide as well. Youngin, you need to get my armor fixed so I can continue killing critters around my farm. Well, whenever you're ready, re ready, ready, I can't speak. Whenever you're ready, old timer, I'm ready to go. <laughs> okay. Here, how much do you have? I do have 200 hide. That's all I have right now. You want to need, like, a For that fancy okay. Lord's armor? Probably about 30 coin. Well, I wouldn't call it fancy. I'd call it decent. Yeah, yeah, you uh, uh, I, I, I excuse I got, you, I sir. I, I, that's the finest uh, work <laughs> in this whole dang city. I tell you, you what, it's extraordinary. Flip? Yeah, got well, Miss Cora, darling, it flint was flint wonderful flint. to see you. I'm gonna run off with yeah, Cardigan yeah, and try and get yeah. this the armor repaired. Let y'all talk about that shoulder, little monkey. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs>
right, it's good buddy. to see you, Mr. A. Well, you, you know oh, you too. Hey, you know where I'm my so house happy. is, right? Pleasure to see well, you all. Hey, hey. As soon as you know how much uh, you, you want, uh, <laughs> why don't you come, uh, come over, come by and tell me. Okay, so all right, here we go. Hey, I gotta get back to my house. Have a good day. Free water. Oh, it tastes so good now. Now that I moved it. So, I close yeah. that door. I don't want no one seeing me in my underwear. All right, hold on because I don't like. I don't want that. Floor. I don't want that stuff on the floor. You can go ahead and stick it in this box I over here. The other day. Oh, okay. That sounds like one of your conversation. There we go, partner. Wash my glasses while you're at it, would you? Yes, of course. It's a full service round here. Oh, thank you, partner. It seems like these windows should be shorter. <laughs> I, I may have to agree with you there. <laughs> Hey, I lit the fire. <laughs> well, thank you. <clears throat> You're welcome. What did the vultures do? They just explore the land? Is that what they did? I lit some more fires. Hey, you son of a gun. That That's that, that's Firestone. That stuff ain't cheap. I got bunches. I don't need them. That's free as far as I know. <laughs> do you want to buy some of that? Quite possibly. I, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with it first. I, I don't exactly know what I'm smelting in there. Oh. All right, Mr. Abe, that your, your gear's ready to go in there. Oh, thank you, buddy. You're a fine fella. Well, of course, that, that'll be 30 gold. Oh, we gotta run down to the bank. Excellent. I imagine that's going to be a discount because, well, with the way the blacksmiths were talking, it seems like the prices are about to go up quite a bit. So uh, I, I'll try to keep it steady for you, but I do imagine uh, other lords going to pay a pretty penny if they want their stuff repaired. They just tell let us that there is hell to pay if what I ha want doesn't happen. <laughs> yeah, hell, I yeah. say. <laughs> All right, I'm, I'm gonna meet you over there. I gotta, I gotta clear my head for half a second. Okay, I was gonna transfer it and see if you notice. <laughs> oh, all right. Work? You just gotta talk to the bank lady and tell her to transfer it to a Cardigan Ramshackle. Sounds good, bud. See if Alistar and uh, Lance, no, not Lance. Did it work? I don't know. I'm about to go find out. Oh, I thought it might send you a message and say, hey, little birdie on your shoulder, this is happening. <laughs> nope, nope. I got to talk to this here fine bank lady to see what's up. She's rude. Yep, looks like it went through. Looks like it went through right fine. Oh, good. What do you think the number is to this door? Have you tried one, two, three, four? That's a I mighty fine did. door there. I want doors like that. That's freaking amazing. I got the ingots for it, but I didn't got the know-how. I'm gonna have to work out some kind of deal for with Ariel so I can get myself some fancy doors like that too. Oh, heck yeah, heck yeah. Ooh I need a goddamn horse. Oh, that's some fine gear there. Thank you. You made it for me. 
<laughs> yeah, that's a fine gear there, too. I was talking about Mr. Lance. Oh, oh, here's the freaking market. I've been looking all over for this dead damn thing. Don't put the sign right there. Then it's hard for me to look in the box. Yep, that, 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 that very true. There's some of that with redstone that I got. I got more. It's prettier. Oh, looks like they got a pretty good deal for that organic polymer in here. Oh, that's handy. Oh, I should grab a few coins, buy some shit and stuff. I mean, I'm stocked. I'm Lord, and I shouldn't swear all the time. Oh, never mind. It, it's a little pricey. It's only for one piece, four gold. I mean, I guess that's still decent. What do you use it for? I do believe there's some fancy flack I can make that uh, needs it. I'm going to have to go see about uh, how much, see if it's worth it. Worth one each. Well, you go do your check-in. I'm going to go grab some, look at some stuff and buy some things maybe. I don't know. Oh, all right. Hey, if you head back to the farm, come find me first, and I'll, I'll escort you out there. i got to bring your guys' presents anyways. Oh, yeah, I forgot about those. Thank you for the reminder. Yep, yep, I got you. Holy crap. Is that you, oh, Miss Sophie? Oh, oh. Yes, sir. I got them ingots for you. I was going to bring out... Oh, nice. In this here box. Oh, cool. I'm very happy. Thank you. Is that what you came by for? Yeah, I was actually wondering how it was going. Didn't expect you had so much yet. Thank you. Oh, yep. Yeah, no way. Actually, I just uh, got into my last stash and... Just decided to give it to you early, just in case I forgot. Oh. <laughs> no worries, I'll, I'll no worries. Oh, that's what I need to do. I got to go find uh, go. Mr. Hemlock uh, up at the Lord's Manors. I, oh, I, I sure hope you. he's still awake. I'd like to. Hey, is that the same Mr. Hemlock from the old days? I have no idea. I do believe he was from a former bastion. I don't know, though. I wasn't there. You weren't there. No, you I was not. You think he was from there? I think so. I do believe I heard him talking about uh, some stuff like that. Oh, good. He's a fine fella. I live up here, too. Oh, I know, I know. I seen you. I helped you set up, you remember? Oh, yeah, that was you, your assistant. Fine young man. You and that other fella. Uh, your well, lordship, Hamlock. It doesn't look like Close he has door. a door. Maybe he's moved. Uh oh, maybe even closer to me. There's 
Have you tried yelling? Baby lives across the way. I think he does now. It looks like he moved. What? I said I think he might now. It looks like he moved. He, he's no longer in this house. Mr. Hamlock, your lordship. Yes. <laughs> yep, yep, you're definitely a lord too. I was just teasing. You can just call me a... Hello, my friends. I'm looking for oh, Mr. Hello. Hamlock. Is that you, Hamlock? Yes, sir, yes. That's some fine gear you got. Well, I, I totally spaced it. I missed, meant to ask you earlier because I've been getting lots of questions about, uh, well, making higher quality type stuff. Tell him no. Dang it, old man. <laughs> I mean, your oh, lordship. That's right. You can call me old man. I don't care. <laughs> so, oh, it's a load of will. So, oh, Mr. Yeah. Pudwacker's been asking me about, like, higher quality tools so they don't break as quickly. Uh, I don't know if that's it within our abilities or whatnot. Of course, of course. I'll answer that momentarily, but uh, please, uh, gentlemen, I'd like you to meet the Lord here. Uh, so, are we Lord? Nice to meet you. Oh, I remember you, young Mark. You're a fine fella. Yes. How are you all doing? My name is Abe Green. You can call me Abe. I'm a farmer, but I guess I'm a lord too. Well, it's oh, nice, nice to meet you. To meet you. Oh, nice to meet you all too. What's your name, boys? Alistair. Alistair? Uh, I'm nice Gavin. Gavin, nice to meet you too, my friend. And, and I'm Thomas. Thomas, Thomas, nice to meet you. Here's a fine. Are you all guards? Uh, I'll be right back. back. Oh, what do I you am do? a stable head. Oh, that's some exciting news. I have some real exciting news. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a farmer, so you know, if you ever need any vegetables, you come to me. I'd like to talk to your lord of actual stable masters if I get the chance. Make a little deal. Yeah, well, oh. we're gonna need a lot of carrots. Oh, I know, and I promise you, I have hundreds. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Well, you know, I'd like to make a little deal, and we'll all work together, maybe. Oh. So, Mr. Hemlock, how are you doing? It's good to see you again. Yes, it's good to see you, old friend. It's been quite oh, some time. It has been quite a while. I've been, oh man, <laughs> boat trips and islands. Freaking love it. Finally Abe. made my way back here. You know, I'm from here originally. Yes, yes. You must be too. You must be in the bloodline. You can tell <laughs> yes. he's got a strong jaw just like me. <laughs> think anyone stronger than you, Abe. Oh, well, I do my best, but you know, it's hard work out there on the farm, lifting and toting and carrying and, you know, and fighting off the wolves. And... Well, speaking of ways, you guys be careful if you ever go out there. It's right dangerous, even for guards. Oh, yes. Oh, that's, that's what uh, Hemlock keeps saying. Oh yeah, the dire wolves. They, they, they're, they're evil creatures straight from the depths, I tell you. They glow red in their eyes and they'll strike terror in the strongest of men. Yes, in fact, I was just saying that these guards, perhaps they could uh, be hired to escort some farmers or stable hands there if needed. Oh boy, you know, that would sure be nice. Maybe we could, you, the guards and I could make a deal like, uh, like for days when we want to bring in a whole bunch of food into town so I don't have to run it and just hope I make it. <laughs> well, that's true. I'm willing to nice little caravan. Uh, that's going to be like awesome. A fun time. How about you, Gavin? 
I'm definitely in. Oh, that sounds good, fellas. Oh, it makes me happy. Well, you know, um, just in case you can't talk to me, Gemma's my number two farm hand right now, and I got a couple others out there, but we all plan on working as a big team. Oh, that's good. We need everyone to be family around here. It'd be it's well, bad when people try to go for themselves. Hey, that's for sure, partner. I can tell you guys have a have a strong, strong, wise brains. Well, yeah, is anything happening? Everybody sound went up at the same time. <laughs> oh, yes, I noticed that as well. <laughs> I felt kind of left out. I didn't say anything just in case I should have done it too. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't see the signal, Abe. We gave the signal. I know. I got <laughs> these new glasses, but they're not as helpful as they can be. Then I just try. I'm working hard, you know. Yes, yes. It's good to see you again, Abe. It's good to see you, my friend. My goodness. Oh, you too. I can't Glad wait. Glad you've been fighting off the wolves out there. Oh boy, there were three of them that jumped me on the way earlier, and thank gosh I had this fine armor Mr. Cardigan made for me. Oh man, yes. it was quite a battle. You guys would have enjoyed it, I tell you what. There was old jumping over rocks and slashing and chopping. Oh boy. <laughs> old Abe came out victorious, so it was close. I limped back home, I tell you what. That's why I need to talk to your stable masters, you know, because I need me a nice mount. Yeah, well, uh, let's see, I just got shoes. Uh, so I <laughs> guess I could I work I... on, uh, something else. Well, you know, my friend, I always say no hurry, no worry. And you take care of business, you know, because you got to set yourself up, find a house, get a bed, uh, maybe a chair. Oh, a chair. Yes, it's, I, I reminds me, I forgot to buy my freaking bed. Because <laughs> you understand the glory that is sitting down. Oh, oh you should have seen me on the stairs earlier. Oh, just sitting Ooh. comfy. Oh, no, no, I like almost died running up. Like, oh, stamina oh, required. Oh, There's a there, lot of them dang stairs. What? I'm, I'm oh. an old man. They need to get like a, like a couple horses to run me up and down. <laughs> like has anyone ever fallen because that'd be like an eternity of like falling and falling and falling and falling before you even hit solid ground oh it would i was on the wall one day and i almost fell but i don't remember how i got up there <laughs> it was really exciting <laughs> that's excellent uh cardigan really quickly um actually the quality is actually the exact same there's no uh, higher quality however there are higher quality, like, I would say, like mithril armor. There's also types of armor you can make. You can use alloys, uh, firestone, gold, various other sets of armor that provide a much higher quality. But to answer your question about uh, the tools or anything like this, there's there's no, you know, I guess, <coughs> in, in a certain sun, you would see like a reflection of blue or purple. That, that does not exist. Oh, all right. I'll just make it sure. I'll, I'll have to relay that to Mr. Pudwacker. That, that's fine by me. Uh, but uh, that mithril, you said mithril. I, I haven't seen none of that in my smithy. Yes, in fact, uh, mithril. I mean, I've just heard rumors of it, but no one, no one has actually found it. Oh, it's... that sounds like an adventure. Oh, that sounds yes. like a good time. Yes. <laughs> it's quite, uh, I don't know. No one... No one knows where it is. There's even just rumors that it even exists. I mean, it's truly the stuff of legend. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. We must I have need to, to find do a... something about this mystery. Yes, I, I want to find a hunter that's willing to go find it. And then try to escort him there, so... Ah, God, as much as everyone keeps talking about it, I want a pair. Yeah, I'm <laughs> thinking get some of that. Everybody want to be your friend. <laughs> I like me a mithril sword, that's for sure. Keep them wolves at bay. Oh, mithril shoes. I'd never have to worry about stepping on anything ever again. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a fine idea. <laughs> oh, you're a wise man. 
Well, I spent a good, good long portion of my life doing nothing but running around. Oh, boy. Oh, it's time to relax. Uh, actually, no, there's no time to relax. It's time to go train stuff. Oh, that's always chores to do, that's for sure, that's for sure. Oh. Yeah, when, when Thomas is ready, maybe he can go and check out the, uh, the stables in the farm area. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's usually, you know, well, now, lately, there's been people around most of the, well, a lot of the time, and I'm around a lot, and if I'm not in town... And if I am in town, I'll be in that house straight across the way, the one on the end. Okay. You can just come give me a holler. I I'll, I'll always help escort people too, you know, because I'm always running back and forth. Well, if I ever need you, I'll come over there shouting, old man. <laughs> I'll prefer an answer. <laughs> and you'll get one. I like you, folks. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, what a beautiful day. And it's finally cold enough for my allergies not to be bothering me. Oh, well, that's excellent. Thanks. My back still bothers me, but I got lots of medicine for that. Oh, good. no. <laughs> oh, boy, yeah. Here we go. Excellent. Oh, I can only imagine the things you grow on that farm. I'm sure they all <laughs> help out. Well, I gotta find more things to grow, that's for sure. Now I want some dang mithril. I want to go on an adventure. And luck, you got you got my juices rolling. I tell you. <laughs> I don't know. It may not exist even. It's truly the stuff of legend. But we'll that's see. Sure. We will. That's for sure. Oh boy, Cardigan, did you need to do anything else while we're here? Oh no, he answered all my questions. I do appreciate that, your lordship, Mister Handlock. Of course, my friend, and no need to call me your lordship, trust me. <laughs> oh, very well. You and Abe cut from the He's same cloth, it was same. Oh, yes. Oh, that's <laughs> right. Hard workers. <laughs> Men of the people, as it were, I guess, yeah. Yes, sir, yes, sir. That's oh, how you okay. get well, some I respect. we wearing this stuff than anything. Well, you know, if it wasn't for those darn wolves, I'd probably be just dressed in my, my, my cloth. Right. Saved your life there. Oh, it sure did. It sure did. It was a close one. <laughs> Had to lay down for quite a few hours. <laughs> yeah, stop freaking yawning. I'm glad you met Cardigan, though. He's been an excellent, excellent smith. Thanks oh, yeah, shouldering. I was lucky. Yeah. I was lucky. One of the first days I, I, I showed up, I met him, and... Uh, I actually made a little deal with him to become the, the farming uh, blacksmith. So, you know, uh, he could Excellent. work there at the farm, have a little shop, and, you know, together we can all do, get get our chores done a little easier. Yeah, I'm an honorary oh, farmhand now. That's right, that's <laughs> right. <laughs> like I don't got enough that's to do. <laughs> yeah, right, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> It'll be a bit, be a bit easier now that we got a whole mess of blacksmiths. That's gonna be nice. Oh, that's right handy, right handy. I just need somebody to make me some furniture for my house. Yeah, I saw some builders earlier. Quite a few oh, of them today. Good. Is there a lord of the builders? I don't believe I've met that lord. Supposedly there is. I have yet to meet them as well, actually. I'm sure they're building themselves some sort of extravagant house. <laughs> <laughs> probably, probably. <laughs> uh, but I would say too to the guards, if there's a, do you need a, to leave a note to introduce yourself to the uh, Lord of the Guards? I'll give you some thatch if you need well, some. That's what I was right. Oh, excellent. <laughs> I'll let y'all get I can't business, even then. put it I'll in hope there. to see you soon there, Mr. Card again. <laughs> What? I, I oh, told wait, you I was escorting me, you, you to the to the farm. I gotta give you and Jenna oh. that gift. It was a pleasure oh, uh, yeah. speaking with all y'all, especially you, Mister Hamlock. Uh, thank you again for the information. Good day, y'all. Thank you. I will see also, y'all thank you for your too, confidence in my ability. I'll do my best to make you proud while you're away. Oh, you can do an excellent job, Cardigan. Cardigan, I have no uh, no doubt whatsoever, my friend. He has been doing uh, a good job, Mister Hamlock. I do be, think yes. we can put anything inside his mailbox. Oh, those oh, mailboxes, you kind of got to put them on one of these little signs, otherwise they, 
Uh, it work. appears to have some kind of lock. Somehow right. Chick Chick figured out how yeah. to get it to work on the side of his house, though. I don't know how he did that. I couldn't figure that out. Oh. What about this box? Can you enter there? Oh, oh, don't all, all you have fellas, to do is have a walk. fine day. Good luck to you. My... Take care, well, gentlemen. Good to see you. <clears throat> Take Good care. to see you, too, access. my friend. Woohoo! <laughs> Wait up, Cardigan. You're too fast. It looks like Hemlock has moved over here now. That's good to know. Oh, that is good to know. Hey, come over here. I go, want to do go into your real house quick real quick. While well, I remember, because I don't have one of those things on my house. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to go inside your house and, and clear my head for a moment. Oh, sounds like good plan. Let's see. I think I got to actually make one of those things. All right, I'll be right back. All right, buddy. And I will be right back. I got to refill my cup. I have returned. All right, Mr. Abe, I'm 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 ready to go. Oh, okay, just a second. I kind of got a little trouble here. Oh, all right. I, I, I take your time. Don't you worry about that. Hey, come check this out and see if it works. All right, looks like someone stole your tree. Yeah, sons of bitches. I even had a sign in front of it letting them know it was Adrian's goddamn tree. Yep, yep, that, that mailbox works right fine. Oh, hell yeah, that makes me right happy. Excellent, excellent. <laughs> well, all right, let's get on out to the farm and things like I don't think I got anything else to do. I brought the, I got carrots here, I got carrots there, I got carrots freaking everywhere, and I don't got a horse. <laughs> All right, I gotta stop by the, the 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 smithy real quick to pick up your guys' gift, but then uh, we can head out right after that. All right, on. I was hoping you could fix up my pick. 
Oh, I could probably well, do you that. To clean my teeth. <laughs> Dang, that's some hard teeth. Uh, I, I know. I drink lots of milk. Uh, by decree of the Lord of the Blacksmiths, though, that's going to be 50 cold. You're going to be 50 coins. I'll knock your teeth out and show you how my pick works. All right, it'll be 40 for you, Abe. That might be a better deal. <laughs> well, I mean, if you're not a hunter, you're supposed to be paying premium prices. That is, I'm a lord. That's a hunter. Well, then you can afford it, damn it. No, I can't. I got freaking mouths to feed. Maybe you need to talk to your king and see if he give you right proper amount of money. Our so you king. Can do your, well, I mean, I guess it is our king. Apologies. Don't let him know That's I said right. that. That's right. I'll knock you out. <laughs> I'll show you knocked out. You put, put that down, son. I'll, freaking, <laughs> I'll show you. You remember who made this armor? <laughs> uh... That's right. It's good armor. wait till I'm gonna wait till it breaks more then fuck it <laughs> all right yeah that's probably a good idea <laughs> I am glad I've been using my stone one for little things and that one only for the good ones like that red stuff that you want so bad well I'm, I mean I'm gonna to need it. it in the future but I don't know I what to do it, with it right now I bet it'll melt mithril's that, that's what I'm figuring, or or, or at least uh, some some of the fancier stuff I got, like the silvers and stuff and the golds. About to break into Mo's box because that some bitch ain't awake, and I need that silver. Oh, man. I do suppose I could go out and get it myself. If you want to do a break in, we could do that. Well, I mean his box is we'll like right in. over here. But I mean, it's Mo. I don't really want to do that to him. But he, I mean, I, I'm gonna pay him afterwards, so it wouldn't be that crazy. Well, you can. Oh, maybe you should just hold off and wait. Probably. It's right here. It's just tantalizing me looking at it. Oh man. The treasure's inside. Can you imagine what we the could treasure. do? We know it's there. <laughs> <laughs> Got to get away before, before, before I, the, the temptation takes over. That's right. Let me check my mailbox real quick, just in case. I'm gonna read these notes once we get to the farm. Okay. All right, we should be good. Are you on top of my roof? No, I'm on top of somebody else's roof. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cardigan. I'm not going to be responsible if you hurt yourself. Are you sure? I never hurt myself. Look, I'm the king of the bank. <laughs> Son of a gun. I Hello. forgot to do it again. What'd you forget to do? I'm gonna go do it real quick. I'm trying to buy one of these beds off of Miss Ariel. I need a fancy bed. She had one in her box. Oh, where is her box? Right over here. <sighs> she got stairs and stuff in there for sale. Oh, nice. Did you buy the bed? I don't see a bed. Just yep, I bought the bed. Where'd you go? You're quick like the biggest. Boo! Holy crap, you scared me into the wall. <laughs> <laughs> I got you good, didn't I? <laughs> Damn good. Whoever built these stairs is freaking genius. I love it. I'm about to have myself some stairs up here soon because I want I want a nice patio up here. Oh, that's a good idea. 
And plus, it makes it easier for me to jump around on. We're gonna be cat burglars. Look at us now. Ooh. Not like either of us need the money. We Whoa. do it for the thrill. <laughs> the thrill, the adventure. That's right. Oh yeah, it's kind of far to jump down over here. We need a high dive. Ow, something best out of your freaking ankle. I told you to be careful. There's some poop right they there. They need parking spaces. Well, no, nobody's supposed to actually what? be parking in the city. You're supposed to leave your stuff out in the stable unless you're loading and unloading. But I imagine this here is like some, something for the lords or something. They do what they want. Oh, yeah, I do what I want. Oh, good medicine. Yep, might as well stock up before you get out. Heck yeah. Don't be passing out on me. I'm not carrying you inside. <laughs> me? Never. <laughs> what do they got here? Uh, 34 year old uh, Megalosaurus. Now, do you think they're selling them after giving them, you know, a, you know, aging them up a bit, like, or do you think they're leaving them at, at the, you know? I guess it depends. Uh, it, it, what, what, uh, if it was like used already or not, if it was second hand. Uh, I imagine it's, it's just clean me. though. I, don't know. I bet you it. it I mean, I imagine you come in here. Well, that, that's not gonna do you no, no good. But I imagine they're, they're going to be sold uh, as is, like, or uh, as what they were tamed at. That's what I would hope. That's what I want. You know, I don't want... I mean, the one, last one I bought had, time. like, 21. Or like, I could, I could train it for, like, 21 days after that. Oh, shit. Hey, you don't know any place to get a saddle, do you? Nope, I do not. Uh, I you really need a like stable a master mouth. for something like that. I met, Maybe the stable master has... Uh, a saddle at his uh, at his lordship. I don't know if he sells stuff in boxes over there or not. Hmm. Did you want to go up and check? That might be a cool idea. If I could get a freaking saddle, I'd buy that stupid horsey duck thing. All right. Well, if there's if there's not a saddle, then I'm gonna buy that freaking horse. What? <laughs> well, you only have one. I got two. It's not a horse, by the fair. way. It's a deer. Whatever. They all got legs. Oh, hello there. All right. How are you today? I don't believe we've uh, met. We have not, but a uh, discussion. Oh, all right, all right. Well, I, then you obviously know me. Uh, what's your name, sir? He needs to get inside. Yes, this is what's trying to get Oh, let's go inside, on, then we're all going inside. inside. I want to get you with my, to my torch out to keep you warmer. You. You're welcome, I, my friend. My name's Abe this. Green. Do you got one of them one of them heaters? You should always carry one of those around. I do, but I was just trying to get back within the walls. Of the city. Excellent, excellent. Just making sure, sir. You may call me Trader Vo. Trader Vo, I like that. That's nice. Much better. Oh, good. It's nice and warm. This is his lordship, oh, hi, Abe. Abe. Oh. You can just call me Abe. Now, how about Sir Abe? <laughs> well, I appreciate it, you know, if you feel, if you feel uh, like, well, you know, I like people to do what they like to do, and it's just nice to meet you. What was your name again, sir? Uh, my 
first name is Naringo. Trader Vo. Naringo. 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 Well, that's a hard name, but it's a beautiful name. He said you can call him Tr Trader Vo. Trader Vo. Naringo. Am I saying it right? Naringo. Yes. I like that. Naringo. Beautiful name. I'm going to try and call you Narinvo. Because, Wish. you know, unless you like Trader Bo better. No, no. Both are fine. It's just that I find people in this room find Trader Bo a bit palette. Oh, yeah, you know. But I think names are just beautiful, you know. My name's Abe. It's just a simple name. But it's a nice name. Hey, look who I see. Hey there. Just a second. You? It sure is. I thought I recognized you. Is over that there. you, Jamma? Noreen Vo. It's wonderful to see you again. This is our new friend, Noreen Vo. You can call him Trader Vo you. if that's too hard. Green Vo. Trader Vo. It's nice to meet you. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. Well, what sort of work do you do, Mr. Vo? I'm one of the many new blacksmiths. Oh, exciting. Is there a doctor around here? I do I believe saw over Dr. by Tora the Father. Yeah, over by, by the, the church. church. Fantastic. Thank you, guys. Yep, there, you're yep. welcome. They need a law about those things running around and bumping into people. Well, as long as they're not parked, I believe there's no law against anything. But yeah, you should probably be careful running around the city at least. That's right. Oh, I have one. Oh, yeah. We were going to run and see if we could find me a, a saddle. Oh, right. well, I have How you both you here. I might as well give you your gifts now. Oh, thank you, Card, again. What are they? I'm excited. One's for you, one's for Jamma. Oh, nice. Things started one, at the farm. one for you and one for Jamma. That, that's yours right there, Jamma. Oh, Jamma, grab that thing on the ground. Oh, oh what did you... What did Cardigan, you start you're with? a dough. <laughs> oh, I got all the fertilizer bins going, and I got some more tatch, and then I planted a few more crops, oh, and I, uh, I made... End. I made some torches to put in front of the houses because it's so dark at night. That's for truth. That's for truth. It is a very dark place there. Oh, I made a few, but I've got to make a few more. I want to farm some more wood. But I thought oh, I'd come into the go. city. See if there's any yeah, shopping I could do. Oh, here. Uh, Cardigan, you were going to show me where the po potential saddle might be. And maybe we could show Gemma where the little... Uh, the places where they're having the market. The shops. Yep, yep. All right, Mr. Yeah. Trader Vo. Uh, it was a pleasure to meet you, and do come to me if you have any questions. Uh, uh, I welcome you as a brother blacksmith. Hello. Oh yes, and the bank, of course, is straight ahead. Yes. Well, them some fancy there. tattoos. Where'd you get them? As apologies, I don't think we met. It's wonderful to meet you, Trader. I'm Zachary. Pleasure to meet you as well. Zachary. Oh yeah, well good luck to you, sir. I like your hair too. To that that's you fancy. How would you do that? that? I, I, I might that's need something like day. that in the future. You, you are a hairstylist or you have a hairstylist? I'm, I'm a pretty good hairstylist. Oh, what is it that you do, Mr. Zachary? I'm a blacksmith. Oh, oh, nice, nice. Well, I, then you must know who I am. I am Cardigan Ramshackle, blacksmith extraordinaire. And in charge for the next three days. Yo, I guess, yeah. I, I didn't know about that till last minute. I didn't even know about the dang meeting. I just got told by Mr. Snook. He's like, all the blacksmiths are gathering at the, the, the courthouse. And I was like, oh, shit, I should probably get there. <laughs> yeah. 
All right, well, it was nice to meet you, Mr. Zachary. I do hope uh, our business is fruitful in the future, and you do come to me if you have any questions or you need any help getting started. And do let me know where you get them fancy tattoos. I need to get see myself a uh, tattoo artist. Uh, it runs in my family line. Oh, that's not. Nice. Maybe I'll come to you in the future to get myself tatted up. I, I mean, I, I do like to run around without yeah, no. without my shirt and everything. No. Oh, that's nice. I like oh, that. Oh, those are wonderful. That's real nice. I would might maybe that'd be like a blacksmith mark. I like that. There you go. Oh, now the farmers need one. Unfortunately, it probably looks like a lump of turd. <laughs> Oh, that would be fantastic, too. All right, Mr. Zachary, we'll get out of the way. What was that? Sorry. Yeah. I need to go get metal. I need to start saving up to get me a mount. I need me a horsey. Oh, yes, of course, of course. I'm pretty pricey right now, but hopefully the, the prices will uh, stabilize soon. All right, good luck on your journey, and you be safe out there. Yes, be safe, my friend. Uh, yeah, we had to do it for uh, Carter again. She's kind of creepy. She doesn't say anything. She just stares at you. Yes, oh. yes. Hello. All right, let's go check the market. It's back here. She's not going to talk to you. There's a big sign right here that says, hey, wait, wait. Oh, wow. Hey, That's what does that say? Fun. You said you learned how to just read. I have learned how to get out of my way. <laughs> oh, I can read it if you cannot. No, no, I no, no he learned. Really on, he learned, so we we'll let him try. Oh, of course, of course. Oh, okay. Not cold. Mark. I don't have things Mark. sticking through my armor anymore. Mark. Mark it. I That's right. You. There you, you sort go. Of said it before we got, got here, but it did sound good out. That's a fine job you did there, Abe. Oh, uh, yes, but I've left it in the I really like right, Let's see what's going on over here. There's a Dr. Bastion. Maybe. Is this person really selling thatch? That's what I was kind of wondering. I mean, I understand that the narco berries kind of. Barely. Oh, that's nice. That is really nice. Did you see this, Cameron? No, I haven't. I haven't looked at this one yet. Oh, there's some neat things in there. Some embroidery, embroidery stuff. Beautiful. Oh, my goodness, clothes. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you might be happy. We're quite expensive, though, for the fur. Oh, well, yes, yes. Us farmers, we're going to try and make as much cash as we can, and we're going to split it up once a week. I think fairly even. I'll take a little extra. But that's because oh, I have know. medications. Oh, you know, because since this is the market, look, my house is right here. Right where? Here. This one's my house. Oh, Jesus, it's here. <laughs> It's right in the market square. If we, we could put up some, if we wanted to sell anything here. Yep, yeah, looks like I it's like gonna work plan. out right nice for y'all. I never oh, realized that was going to be the market when I picked out the most. This is perfect. Serendipity, or as they say. Serendipity, all the three of them. And you're able to access everything in my home, right? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. 
<laughs> you guys can change that a bit if you'd like. If you just think, think real hard about Well, no, I'm just saying because if we want to put up a cooler here or cold storage and such to sell things here in the city, that, you know, Abe would have a, access to it. Yeah, Quite yeah, easily actually, I trouble. have a couple of cold storages up at the, at the at the mansion. I could bring them down here later, and maybe we could figure out. Where put, I kind of like. All right, check out this. What, what do you think? We make our little farmer market like right in here. Would that be okay, or should we make it? I uh, know. I think it'd outside? be wonderful. Oh. Okay. You know, I was kind of thinking of making a. Um, oh, I got some uh, bad like news a, too, Jim. No peasants allowed. I got bad news in his head. Oh yeah, the bad news is, I've been telling everybody you're my number two farmer. So, so you're, so they might, you know, come and bother you. I'm so sorry. you got some responsibility. Oh, no problem. Oh, okay. I didn't want, I didn't want to do that, but I have to tell somebody something, and and you're the one. Oh, no problem. I'm honored to actually have the position. But you know what you're oh, thinking good. right here? We should put uh, maybe a couple little fence and put a little farmer's market right here. Oh, we we'll really stick up the signs right at the back of the house. Oh, I'm, I'm super excited. Oh, this is, look at this. is great. This is great, KB. Oh, this. God dang it. Kitchen control. All right, well, once you guys are done uh, planning this out, did you want to go up to the Lord's house and see if maybe he has a box up there selling saddles? Well, we could. We could. Are you busy, Gemma? You want to run with us, or are you going to do some more shopping? Um, do you need any money? No, I'll run with you. Um, I was going to try and um, see if I could buy a bed over at... Um, across the way. Oh, at, at, at Alice? Something and the lady starts with an A. Hello, Ariel. Ar Ariel. 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 Ariel, yes. Oh, Thank it's you. such a beautiful name, and it just was at the tip of my tongue. That's right. I'm terrible. But, at um, names. I'll run up to the to the to the mansion with you if you'd like some company. All right, he sounds good. I think the cardigan bought the last bet, too. He should give it to the lady. It was a fancy oh, bed. It cost okay, eighty no. coin. Oh that's no, I don't want present. a fancy. That's a fine present. Thank <laughs> you for this wonderful new present. Are you giving it to me now? I ain't giving you nothing, old man. I already gave you a nice for a he coat. Is such a, he is a money grubber. I tell you what, Gemma. Money but grubber. He's a good fella. Money grubber, brother. How many deals have I given you? <laughs> you always forget Three, how to count. One, two. Three, four, five, seven, <laughs> seven, eight. Yeah, we had quite the influx. Wonderful. It's amazing. Yeah. I had oh, we had a blacksmith excited. meeting earlier. There's so many new blacksmiths. There was like there was like ten like of us 100. all in a group. Oh my goodness! I've been out on the farm. Start... Oh yeah, that's been crazy in town. But we're gonna have to start collecting lots of stuff and selling it to blacksmiths because there's gonna be a lot of them. I'm up for that. Heck yeah. <laughs> I heard some up. stories about something called Mithril. No one found it. Mithril? Yeah. Oh, it wasn't that easy. It doesn't look like he's got a box out there, but didn't we see that stable hand fella? Did he say his name was Roger or something like that? Oh, yeah. I wonder if we could find him. He could probably make you up something. Oh, that's a fine idea. Here's old fast card again. Keep that for 
boxes for you. That way, if you want to start cooking, you can start selling some lovely food that are used all our wonderful vegetables. Oh, I love that idea. Me too. We'll have to make food. <laughs> Hello, Lin Lin. <laughs> Sorry about that. I didn't, I didn't recognize your little hello. <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing fine this evening. Welcome to the show. This is the KP show. It's not the PK show. <laughs> I'm doing fantastic. I'm so excited that we're Bastion's finally open to the public. Been real freaking busy. This is my second stream today, and uh, it's been nonstop RP. It's been fantastic. I hope you're doing well. How are you doing? It's more of a novelty thing. Yeah, I don't know. That guy's a weirdo. Are you talking about me in there? Yeah, a little bit, but not right now. Thought I heard weirdo. Did I lock you out? I'm so sorry. Oh, no worries. I was out collecting some doing? river stones. Oh, well, the habit. I uh, shut the doors behind me. That is an excellent habit. That's awesome to hear, Lin Lin. Well, shoot. I guess I'll have to make a couple more, but that's okay. They're easy. They're not too hard on the... Um, I made one out, out at the farm, but um, I I, uh, I didn't run here from there. I'm still a bit. Um, I wonder if you guys are allowed to sell these things. I could I could probably use one of these fancy things. Oh, those cold storage things. Yep, yep. I I, I want to start cooking, and I, I figure I might need one of those if I want to sell some specialty dishes. Well, maybe oh. you could rent out one of ours. Oh, I could possibly you know do that saying? as well. We'll make a deal. We could I have like, like three or four out there. We'll put a, a code on yours, and you could have a, a yeah. That way, it's not messing with any laws, but it is fully accessible by to by you, there, Cardigan. That sounds right, mighty fine. You could fine. put it with our with our stuff too. Excellent. Over up by excellent. my house on the market there. You're more than welcome to use my space there. Why, well, thank you, Miss oh, wow. Jamma. That's uh, much appreciated. Well, you oh, are yeah, part of the family. It'd be the first food court. That's right. You are part of the family, buddy. You're first. You're an honorary farmer. Honorary farmer. Uh, put four of those little crates in there in that last uh, large storage box if you want them. That way you have them handy. That's right. That's a, quite an honor. I've been honored quite a bit today, that's for sure. I guess I'm like the leader of the blacksmiths for the next three days. I, I'm in charge. That's, that's what Hamlock said. Like. I, I don't know what uh, what I did, but uh, he seems to have confidence in me, and I do appreciate that, that's for sure. And it's probably because he sees all the hard work you've been doing, and you've been helping people and working hard. Well, I do try. I like to see the success of this city. I want us all to do uh, mighty fine. Oh, we will. Don't you worry. Oh, boy. I pulled two. One for us and, and one for Cardigan. Oh, okay. I was just thinking you could keep them over there. That way they're handy. I can always whip up a hundred more oh, if I want. Oh, all right. Well, I'll take them over and stick them in a storage box in the house. There you go. So you're like the, better this than place you. is a bit Bigger bare. Need to get some builders making decorations. Too. Oh man, they can make a fortune. But uh, if you use those storage boxes, you know, the, the big selling boxes, you know, to store your own stuff in, like maybe something that you don't want to lose, like my armor, I'll always put it in my in my table here. You know, oh, under the I owner's thing, right? Yeah. That way, I don't risk losing it. Plus, these yeah, these things, things are, are quite like durable. Freaking, 
Mithril may be tough, but I think these things are tougher. So no one will be able to break in and steal your stuff. And you can always put a code on them too. Like, yep, yep, set a pin code on them so I can't even get at them. <laughs> you know, I keep all my embarrassing items in there. <laughs> there you go. I need some embarrassing items. That's for sure. I keep looking, but I can't find them. I don't but think as soon you, as get, I find you, any, you I'll let you know. ever get embarrassed uh, there, Abe. I'm not exactly sure what embarrassed means, if you want to know the truth. <laughs> Have you? Things that'll make you blush. Oh, yeah, there ain't nothing. I'm too old. You guys see way up there? It's not beautiful. It, 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 do you see that dragon head? It's quite impressive. It's just wonder beautiful. who wonder who carved that out. He must have been quite the sculptor. Oh, it's amazing. Oh, oh, did, do you see that dragon head up there? Yes, I do. I always wondered about that. I'm just glad somebody else sees it, too. It must have been a fine yeah, sculptor. Do some work you see like it that. Too? Oh, I see it for sure. Oh, yeah, that's amazing. I bet it was a relative of mine. Oh, I imagine so. I imagine so. Oh God, no! No one's descended from dragons. You imagine how big a dragon wiener is. Oh, oh my God! My. <laughs> well, really never thought about animals. that. Yeah, I don't think it's possible. It's just, it's just not. It's like it's like a rabbit having love with a bear. Well, may, maybe they got like magic that could make them like into like a human form for a while. Oh, but then they'd grow up to be humans, not dragons. Half dragons, perhaps. But see them. Well, now, 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 no. See them, they'd just be too big, and they couldn't wear clothes. <laughs> I see some people heading this way. Uh oh, we better oh, hide. Back. Abe's here, actually. Oh, <laughs> well, howdy. <laughs> Abe, that's someone here was looking for you. Oh, good. How are you doing, my friend? We, we met, haven't we? Oh, not yet, mate. Oh, no? No, not yet, mate. Name's Bazzer. How do you do? Bazzer? It's nice to meet you. I'm Abe Green. And, you know, these are my friends. This is Gemma, my number two farmhand. And, and you know, I'm number one, I guess. And, and then this is Cardigan. That's, that's, I guess, number two, uh, the blacksmith. <laughs> yes. Wonderful to meet you. Right, well, uh, pleasure to meet you all your acquaintance. Friends? Well, I'm a stable hand, and I uh, I heard a wind from uh, what was the lady's name, the really spicy one. Cora. Right, I heard from Cora that you're uh, willing to do some uh, trading for a horse involving carrots and whatnot. Why, yes, I am. Would you be interested in such a trade? I absolutely, absolutely. I need to, like, you know, start getting the work done, yeah? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I do have some carrots here, as a matter of fact. I was hoping maybe, uh, you know, because I know you, I want to help. I want to be a part of a team, you know, and I was hoping maybe uh, for a small share of your profits, I could supply you all with some carrots. Oh, yeah, like, uh, that sounds pretty good. I'm not, you know, I'm carrots at the moment, so it seems good to me. Oh, what now? I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, it sounds good to me, mate. Like, I'm carrotless at the moment, so, uh, you know, oh, carrots yeah, well, for profits and horses and whatnot seems good. <laughs> That's for sure. I would like to, you know, make the deal with your your lord, of course, but I'd happily make a, a, a temporary one with you, if that's all right. Anything I can yeah. do to help. Yeah, that would be, it would be great, actually. Oh, good, good. Yeah, yeah. how about this? I supply you. How many carrots do you think you'll need for a good five or six horses? Well, it's uh, the problem thing is that they spoil, right? So I'll have to keep some of them on reserve at home in a fridge. But on average, like a, a well-seasoned horse, I uh, will take about you know a dozen or so carrots uh, to break in. Oh, okay, and. Uh... 
And those preserving bins don't keep them, keep the carrots that long, but. Yeah, well, it's but, better than having it in your pocket. Oh, that's for sure. That's for sure. Well, what, what, what say you? Uh, I give you, uh, I'm going to, I'll give you a couple hundred. Or, or how many do you think you want? Uh, well, I think <laughs> right away, like, because it takes a little bit of time to, like, go up and hunt the, the oh, yeah. horse. I'm thinking if you wanted five or six, um, that would actually take about, you know, 150 carrots all up in, in like, spoil times to ensure that, like, I have carrots when I find a horse, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's like, that would be the safe number. About 150. Yeah, just, uh... That sounds reasonable. How about this? I'll give you 150, but you gotta promise me to get me the best damn horse out there. <laughs> yeah, I will deliver it to you personally. That sounds good. And you you know, you know, Baza, <laughs> I think we're gonna have a fine, a fine working relationship, my friend. <clears throat> Yeah, oh, that sounds, makes me happy. I, I've been wanting to get some good. carrots to you folks. Oh, here, let me run and grab 150. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Oh, not a problem. While, while he's doing that, I'd like to discuss a little bit of business. I, I'm going to need a couple of them Megaloceros saddles. If uh, if you could whip mm -hmm. one of them up, I, I'd be right. mighty fine to but, have, uh, uh, pay you for that. Yeah, yeah, like, I would, I would love to, but the problem is, is that, uh, I, would, I don't have, a, like, my working table for making saddles, yeah? Oh, uh, do, do you so need I need to, like, assistance? get one of those up and running. Oh, yeah, so need yeah I need, um, so um, we have the cold storage? Ava's over here. Could we do the same thing? <laughs> Ava's amazing. Oh, my gosh, that's a brilliant idea. Could you hand me one of those, those tables right certainly, now? Certainly, certainly. Right, there it is. Um, according to my notes right here, I'm going to need 20 hide and 15 metal ingots to make the uh, the saddle table. Right, to well, I mean, I, I can get that together yeah, right quick if you want to give me some kind of discount yeah, on the saddles. Spoil and you can give him all he needs. Yeah, yeah, I That's can uh, right. help you out with that. See, I, I only just arrived in. a couple hours ago and then I have to take a nap. So I'm oh, premises yes, all set yes. up and stuff. So, you know, all the sort of resources needed to make saddles and all that stuff. I'm still working on it, right? I'm getting it together. But, uh, like, main plan at the moment is to be able to, like, get uh, a couple of steeds up and running for people, right? Make it easier and safer for me to, like, travel around. Yeah. Most definitely. I wouldn't mind taking one of them horses off your hand, too. I got a little, I'm a little flush right now. I wouldn't mind uh, paying you handsomely. I. I did see they had some for sale down there, but they, the prices seemed a little outrageous. I'm not trying to pay 450 for a one-year-old horse, but I will pay you handsomely. Right, right. I I have yet to peruse the some of the markets and see the going rates for things. Like I don't want to like strictly undercut other stable hands. Oh yes, of course, I will of course. Charge a reasonable price for things. I a sensible pricing, not like you know five weeks wages for like you know key little man that like yeah them one-year-olds are gonna get eaten troubling, right, right quick troubling. as soon as you go outside exactly exactly especially for for people like hunters who like need sturdy steeds to ensure that they're safe most definitely well i can get you the materials you need for your for your uh your table real, real quick if you want to make me up a couple saddles i got a megaloceros that's just uh kind of bareback at the moment right right well uh yeah i could probably start working up on that sort of stuff once our back residence down all right well you just let me know uh, i live uh over by the courthouse uh, in that whole section, you'll see a big sign. It says right, well, "Cardigan Ramshackle Blacksmith Extraordinaire." Right here, right here. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I'll let you know like the moment that I have everything up and running. Uh, I hope you have no saddle, no problem. Excellent, excellent. I do appreciate that. Cardigan's a good man, Baza. The best smith in all of Bastion, actually. In fact, if not the best. Oh, I do. Thank you for them kind words. 
See, he wears glasses. That's how you know he's a well-studied man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, and Mr. Baza, well, we've been thinking, the Jamma, Jamma came up with this idea. That's why she's number two. She's ideas, and, and, I, and I kill the wolves. <laughs> but here, right, come over right. here. This is going to keep the carrots uh, fresher for you. All right, this is going to oh, have a, be... a password on it that only you will know, and yeah. you'll have access to these carrots. And, uh, you know, right, all yeah. I want, for now at least, is a, the biggest, toughest, strongest, a wolf kickingest ho horse out there. <laughs> that I can help you with. Oh, bless your heart. And Gemma, she has the, the pass key for you. That way she I hope knows it's not A you. backwards. It is. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Those are. <laughs> <laughs> Right here, right here. Well, um, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Uh, oh, no problem. And there's 200 carrots in there just waiting for you right now. Well, excellent, excellent. Well, you might I'll want to make sure that code now. works. Oh, yeah, yeah double check the code. Yeah, I was having issues with my Hunter uh, box. It wasn't quite working right. Oh. I'd like a lovely mount as well. And if you can give me the supplies you need for the saddles, I'll get that yeah, for you. Uh, I mean, either I'm, like, really, really bad at, like, putting in part, like, codes and stuff. I just can't get in there. It's one. Yep, okay. Yep. It is, I don't I think would, the pin I've never code's done working this before, on them very so. well. Dang it. Hmm. Let's see. But you can build like a little, a little, a little room, and then you can put a pin oh, code on a door. Oh, and, leave and just leave that unlocked. I could do that. I think, I hope at least. All righty, you tell us how many you need to start with, and I'm going to have a little room hidden back here with one chest right. in it, you know, and, and then you can come get them as you need them. Right, well, uh... Like 150 would be safe. I could get, uh, you know, quick about it. I might be able to get eight or maybe nine steeds out of 150 carrots. Oh wow! Well, yeah. The, the, I'll tell you yeah. this: the farm would really appreciate the, the two finest. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't worry. He'll come straight to you for helping me out. Much appreciated. Oh yeah, Gemma, you get him those, and I'll I'll get to work. <laughs> I'm so glad you brought this feller over there, Mr. Henlock. Yeah. Oh. One more try just for It's just a wonderful, giggle. bountiful day, I tell yeah, you. Yeah, nah, it's just uh, closed on me. Dang tables. How oh, but yeah, like, like you were saying, we, we're going to have to bring that up. Because um, that would be real handy well, to be uh, able to pass, to pass, pass on the like, uh Pass over like 80 of them for now, and I'll pick, I can get the rest later. Just uh, spoiling and whatnot. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I wonder if we'll it didn't work because you put it in the. Hmm. Well, you guys work on that. I'm gonna build a little hut. <laughs> I should have everything here. I need to get these glasses fixed. Wish there wasn't a big crack. Right, yo. Well, we off to do some work now. Uh, much appreciated. Nice meeting you all. And uh, thank you for the introduction, Zemlock. Uh, thanks again. Of course. All right. Welcome to Bastion, my friend. You're already getting started. Your first day. My goodness. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, yeah, I'm off to do work. Yes. Well, stay safe, safe travels. Stay warm. Stay safe. Oh boy, how exciting. How are you, Jenna? I love your pony. I'm good. How are you doing? I'm doing well. It's good to see you. <laughs> Absolutely you, uh... smack to see you, to be honest. <laughs> Keep a name company, eh? Right, he's teaching me quite a lot. Oh, he's keeping me out of trouble. <laughs> <laughs> it's not good really. Now he is quite time. a lot. Oh, have you now? Mm -hmm. 
All right, Mr. Abe, I'm, I'm going to head back down to my, my smithy. I got some things to handle real quick. You come find me if you need me. Oh, I sure will, Cardigan. Thank you for all your wonderful help today. You've been you've been a blessing, I tell you what. Of course, of course. Anything Take for you, old timer. Oh, thank you. Keeps his eye on you. All right, Miss Gemma you, and Mr. Hemlock. You guys have yourself a fine day. I'll catch you guys later. You too. See you soon. Safe travels through the city. Take care, brother. Of course, of course. Man, Coltrane's voice is amazing. He is amazing. I wish I could do something fancy like that. <clears throat> Gotta get some more metal smelting. My hunters are not doing their jobs. Does this say you're a stable hand? That is correct. Oh, very nice to meet you, Thomas. You wouldn't happen to have your table up and go when I need myself a couple saddles. Uh, at the moment, no. I believe I ran into you and the old man up there with Hemlock not that long ago. Oh, oh. Um, well, is there any way I can uh, kickstart your, your table so that you can get a couple saddles made? Uh, well, starting out here, let's see what I need. I <laughs> it's need so good. Ingots, wood, hide, and stone. Well, I can get my hands on most of that. Uh, the stone is the easy. It's dicking to get. Look at all these rocks all over the ground. You can just pick these up for that. But I can yep, get you and ingots and hide. Patch. That would work. Then yep. if you tell me what you need, I can tell you what you... Well, what's needed for the saddles? Most definitely. I, I need a couple Megalocero saddles, but I'll be right back. I'll go get you some ingots and hide real quick. Uh, Megaloceros, I don't actually need the, uh, the smithy to make. Oh, that's fine. I'll still give you, uh, get, get you started. Nice kickstart. I like to help. I like to help right, out. Right. Just let me know what that, you need for the saddles. More the more tabs. Those are the Morello tops. I will actually need the smithy first. Oh, okay. But here, okay. I will come no with problem. you. Let's go collect some stuff. Well, I'm, I'm going to head to my smithy, uh, my smithy, because that's where the ingots are sitting, and I think I might have some extra hide in there. Do you, you want to know where that's at? Right. You can follow me there. Uh, Sure, why not? All right, and yeah, your name's Thomas, right? I apologize. I'm not the Correct. greatest with names. It's nice to meet you. I, I do believe I uh, introduced myself. If not, I'm Cardigan Ramshackle. Uh, nice to meet you. And You're going to be uh, covering for Hemlock. Oh, yes, yes. That, that was a surprise to me. It probably surprised everyone else, too. i would never done nothing like this. Uh, well, I'm Thomas Gallo. It's a pleasure to meet you. We're we're so, sorely missing some stable hands. It's nice to see a few in uh, in town now. You can come into my waiting room right here. Sure. This is actually a fairly large house. Oh, it's not bad. I'm getting set up for when my wife shows up, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna have two businesses out of here. I'd imagine. Yeah, I know my house is gonna be more than enough for me alone. Oh, very. Plus, I didn't want to be good. right in the center of everything. Oh yeah, you're kind of on the outskirts, but you gotta watch out. Them lords can come down to see you right quick, and then them lords can be a little, a little feisty sometimes. Yeah. 
I can deal with the Lord or King. <laughs> yeah, what was that King? Wouldn't be my first time. He was talking about beheading me because I didn't get him his scissors in time. <laughs> uh, yeah, I should probably find some scissors. <laughs> yep, yep, I'll be making up some more here soon. I sell them myself for 15 gold a piece. Well, that's not bad. Yeah, I do offer some free repairs, but I might have to change that. I'll give like the first three repairs for free, but obsidian is so hard to come by that it's, it's going to get a little pricey. It might only be like a gold or two to repair after that, though. Quite large, but I don't know if it's one building or two. Oh, this is one building. Holy shot, this is huge. Oh, Alistair, but, we can be neighbors. Well, let's, uh, I like this one. How about you, Gavin? How about this one over here? All right, I'll oh, drop I'll these right here. Where good. do you at? Yeah, this one right here. Oh, I was looking at. Hopefully this one that right covers here. Uh, the saddles and your and your table. Um, I will you know, go grab trim, some wood real quick. As big as the other one. So the other one's a lot. Or you can go out with me. a bunch of stone. Oh, okay. Actually, yeah, I'll come with you. Okay, okay. Someone talking to us. What do you think? Hello? Oh, nope. It sounds like they're talking to each other. Know. Yep. Yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> yep, yeah. yep. Yeah. There's a lot of voices around here all the time, especially now with the, the new boats arriving. There's been tons of new people. It's pretty exciting. Yep. Yeah, you get them river rocks, you can get some good metal. Oh, I got some metal if you want. I'll drop it here for you. Can't say I'd turn it down. Oh, there you go. I was I was breaking some river rocks up by the Lord. I don't quite need it right this second. So you, you go ahead and take that. Thank you. There of you course, go. of course. We've got to help each other out. I'm trying to figure out what the good price for a horse is for when I sell them. Yes, as long as you don't take take a, a number from the, the last uh, stable I saw, it was like 450 gold for like a one-year-old horse. I was like, that is outrageous. <laughs> that's outrageous. But uh, I do I believe there's, the a, man there's a Mr. Bazaar or Bazaar or something like that. He's out right Bazza. now. Yes. Yeah, Bazza. He he made a deal with the Lord Abe, and uh, they got themselves some carrots now. I do believe he's out taming uh, horses as we speak. Well, that's good. Maybe you guys work out a deal. You guys work together, find them horses, and get it done quicker. Not quite possibly. There was a gray one outside the gates uh, last night. chop this stuff down now do you know how much stone you needed uh, or for wood for that stone. matter uh 50 stone and 60 wood oh that, that that's all oh i got that real quick and i'm not too sure what i'm gonna need for your individual uh saddles after so we'll you just want to take that stack real quick. I'm gonna go grab my Megalocero so that he can help us carry stuff. Sounds good. I see. Get out here, I see. I need. I need your back. Come on, I see we got we got some uh, gathering to do. Oh, you're getting frisky. I like that. <laughs> uh, one day I'll have a voice like Coltrane. <laughs> oh, careful with that sickle. That's a am full of stuff. What was that, sir? Alright, so how much can your Megalosaurus carry? 
Well, I got a bunch of thatch in here already, and it's carrying a, a, a couple hundred uh, wood. You can, I, I can put a little bit more on it though. That's just that should be good because they can't really carry a lot at this point in time. Oh, understandable. Get I'll get you a little more uh, stone too. Let's go, icy. <laughs> I can listen to him for right hours. Just a, imagine him on books tape. I think that'd be awesome. Oh, it's still laying there. Oh, that is very true. I think we're good on resources now, though. Oh, we should be. Is there a well around here? There's one right up here on the left. Come on, Ice, get inside. <clears throat> Freaking Abe. Abe's amazing, too. <laughs> you do his voice so dang good. All right, so. I guess back to my place. Yep, yep, that sounds like a good idea. See, I like it because it's easy to find my place. Used to do a World of Warcraft podcast forever ago, and he has such a nice voice. So <laughs> nice. Oh, a couple steeds right here. Yeah, good job, Baza. Got uh, yourself they're, some they're, nice horses. Oh, man, that was quick. Preliminary for the yeah, preliminary for the time being, like... They're, they're a little young, but I need something to get around in the wilds, and then I need a backup in case anything really bad goes wrong. Oh, most excellent, right. most excellent. Yeah, it's preliminary. I, I'm just back here trying to warm up because it is cold outside. Oh, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Do you need me to carry anything? Oh, no, you look like you're good now. Yep. Just... Had picked up some berries, accidentally threw them on the floor instead of eating them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Am I about to pass out without uh, any food? So I need the stone for now. I got wooden that still too if you need that. Mostly trying to find a place to put this down. Oh, most definitely. Take your time. Can't get too close to the walls. As uh, the Lord Abe says, no hurries, no worries. It's true. Oh, you're excited, one, aren't you, Icy? So, you need another Megaloceros saddle? I uh, Actually, I need two of them. If you need more ingots or something, <clears throat> just let me know. Uh, let's see. Here's what we need exactly. Yes, yeah, so we need 200 hide, 110 fiber, and I have the ingots for uh, six of them. Oh, all right, all right. Well, anything over what? So uh, I guess I just need some hide. It's two hundred. Yeah, two hundred hide per. Uh, if you want to go grab some hide, I will get some fiber. 
there's some fiber. I'll go get right, the hide, that, that though. I'll be, be back. Fiber. All right, I will be here. Excellent. Oh, crap. I don't think I can move with this thing right now. Uh, if you need me to hold anything, just let me know. Oh, no. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Come on, Icy. I'll be right back, Mr. Thomas. What am I holding? Oh, wood. Actually, I mean... Actually, I got... I mean, you can have this wood. Did, did you want it? Just just for extra resources. Uh, sure. And I'm not even going to charge anything extra because of all the help that you've given me, actually. Oh, excellent. Excellent. I do appreciate that. Uh, I'm going to drop this wood and, and some more stone and a bit more thatch. Oops. There you are, sir. I'll be back. Thank you. Time to go kill something. I need your skin. If I can find my way out of here without getting stuck somewhere. Time to find myself a piggy or a sheepy. Pig, There's a couple of pigs, that'll be just fine. Oh, you son of a gun. He passed out and fell off his balcony. <laughs> of course he did. Was he over medicating? That sounds about right. I totally thought you were about to over medicate when we were standing there with that group and you're like, I got my medicine and you started eating it right there. I was like, oh man, he's about to go. <laughs> I tried, but I'm getting intolerant. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Terrible, but fantastic. Old man Abe and all his drugs. Just wait till the, the doctors start making real drugs. <laughs> Abe's going to squander all his lordship money. What's going on here? That's a horse.
have to refill my cup one more time so I can go like another hour or so. do that. I've gotten my smithies and everything up, whereas I don't think he does just yet. Oh, good, good, good. Are you trying to steal my good. business, old man? <laughs> yeah, I don't need to steal it. I've got, I've got all the carrots needed. <laughs> oh, I don't need How no carrots. How many carrots are you selling? I ain't selling carrots, sir. You better back off, little feller. Right. You want a do -si do <laughs> Sounds like you want to dance. <laughs> I'm gonna dance later. <laughs> All right, I got you that. But that I'll hide. Just wait till yeah. <laughs> I'll let him tire himself out, then I'm not gonna. Over. <laughs> I like that. Am I gonna need more hide? Oh, let's go. We got work to do. We got work to do. Right, let's we take do. this horse. Come along, little doggy. Uh, nope, I have both of them being made right now. Excellent, it won't excellent. Let me on it. Stupid dog. Your dog no, feel free to step in if you're cold. Oh no, I'm fine. I'm building a tolerance this cold. <laughs> I'll show you, big sissy old man. Thank you kindly, sir. I do appreciate everything you've done for me. I do let me know if I can be of any more assistance. Well, as a stable master, if you ever come across hide that you are uh, not needing, let me know. Oh, I'm excellent, sure excellent. Deal if you need more saddles. Yep, yep. I'm actually about to go out and uh, collect a little bit of ore myself, so uh, I imagine I'll kill a critter or two, and I'll, I'll think about bringing you back some hide. Awesome. That would be excellent. Excellent, sir. You have yourself a fine day. Pleasure doing business as always. Yes, you do. Pull an aid and pass out. How to get you home? Oh, yep, I'm home. Who is that? I, I'm sorry, I don't recognize your voice. Zachary. Oh, oh, how's it going, Mr. Zachary? Going all right. A couple of questions. All right, step inside and get out the no. storm so I can hear you a bit better. I heard the best source of firestone is in the Badlands. I have yet to be out there uh, myself, actually. Yeah, I don't have a mountain. Yeah, it's quite quite the distance. I haven't been out that far. It's, it's dang dangerous. I recommend talking to a hunter. Uh, hopefully one that's a little bit more established. They, they seem to find it uh, quite a bit. Mithril? Is that what you said? Yeah. Oh, nope. I heard that's a legend. Uh, Mr. Hemlock was just talking about that earlier. He said he said he doesn't even know if it really exists. So what? 
Thank you, PG. Or, or thank you, People's Gaming. Holy crap. Scared the crap out of me. Sorry about that. What what was that again? <laughs> What's the smell for you? You know, I'm figuring that out all myself right now. Um, I have yet to find a use for the... <laughs> thank you, PG. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I just get, don't know what's going on in my head. It's going crazy around here. I have yet to find a use for smelting. I think I might have said that in game. Thank you again. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> I, I, I'm not sure. I, I, I've been back. <laughs> I can't do this. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> uh, I have yet to find a use for the smelter. I got it over here. I got a little bit of firestone in it and everything, but I haven't actually made any more advanced type of the alloys yet. <laughs> <laughs> it's a super freaking host. Thank you so much, everybody. Oh, my heart's all pounding real hard right now. <laughs> it's too many explosions. Yeah, I, I'm not sure. I, I, that's what something else I should have asked Mr. Hamlock. I don't even know if he knows, though. I do know we need some more advanced type uh, materials. I got a little bit of golden brass, but I have. it's hard to find silver as well. <laughs> As soon as I know, though, I'll, I'll put out like a public announcement or something and let all the other blacksmiths know. Uh, I'm going to have to talk to a couple of my hunter buddies and see if they can uh, assist us in finding the more rare type resources. Maybe we go on an expedition out into the Badlands and, and see. I've heard tale that they have the most fanciest of, of, of the materials out there. <laughs> Thank you for the host, Whitlock. You guys are going to make me break character. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's quite the wild west, so I imagine we got We got to uh, take take a nice large uh, party out there when we go. <laughs> Thank you, Lin. Lin. <laughs> uh, right, well, uh, all the questions I had. All right, yeah. As soon as I get more information, I'll definitely pass it along. <laughs> all right. Well, uh, get going then. All right, sir, if there's anything else I can help you with, that I'll be more than happy to help. <laughs> Farewell, Mr. Zachary. <laughs> I don't know if I'm able to handle any more of that. <laughs> did, did I hear bear? bear? Yes, you did, Cardigan. You can hear from a hundred miles away if you mention the beers. That's the elixir of the <laughs> gods. Oh, Father knows all about I that, I know. bet. I'm not arguing. We were just talking about that. He said there's a nice little brewery thing, but it doesn't know if it'll brew the, 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 the beer. Oh, I, I, I heard... Yes, there's I heard you, you, the, the brewing things for, for the doctor stuff, you need like a regular beer barrel. Yeah, this is what I thought as well. I do yeah, wonder yeah. who has access to that, though. We'll find them, we'll hunt them down. You would think it'd be a what. builder like Ariel, you'd think she'd be able to do it. Yes, I would think oh. it'd either be the builders or the farmers, because the farmers would have all the, uh, Oh, that makes the sense too. Should know how to do it. Yeah. Who makes the beer barrels? I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna mention that. Maybe we can have some sort of meeting of the, of the lords or something. Oh yeah, you do have the king's ear, I imagine. So. No, I don't. He has his own ears, sir. I would not steal <laughs> anybody's ears. He would probably notice I'm wake up when I was taking it. Uh. <laughs> I'm still reeling from all those hosts. <laughs> That's right. Uh, host train. Well, I do, I do, I do know him since he was a boy. Oh well, I imagine he'll listen to you, Abe. You're quite old and wise, especially well, old. I am very old. You're especially old. <laughs> I mean, short. <laughs> 
I do believe we're almost what? the same height. Harl, this is God's a priest. I mean, he'll tell us the truth. Who's I think it's his hair. taller than the other guy? Well, considering his eyes are higher than yours, I'm going to have to give it to Abe. Yeah. Sorry, all right, Bob. all right. <laughs> I never said I was taller than you. I just said I wasn't that much shorter. <laughs> well, <laughs> you're a lot shorter. You're I'm a lot shorter. shorter. You're a lot shorter. No, I'm not. <laughs> I shrunk a bunch when I was in my 80s, but I haven't shrunk for a good <laughs> How old years. is Abe? <laughs> if I, if what? In your, uh, how old are you? I don't remember, honestly. That's what I'm wondering. I remember being in my 80s, though, and I was shrinking. Perhaps we cut off a finger and count the rings. Oh, good idea. Here, get, let's see. Let me see one of your no. fingers. No, let's don't do I'll, that. I'll do one. You do one. It'd it be even trade. We got a doctor here. He can, he okay. can sew you right back up. He'll sew you right back up. I'll be fine. I fight wolves for a living. <laughs> Those things are dangerous as can be, too. Don't fight them if you don't have to, my friend. But they're so dang fast. Oh, yes, they'll get right on you before you can even get your weapon out sometimes. They're oh, sneaky son of a guns, too. That's right. They be stalking their prey That's all why. sneaky like. <laughs> That's why, I didn't you know, see a lot of boar out there as well. Those things are not friendly either. <laughs> no, no, they are I, not. I've yet to kill one, but I'm, I'm, I just don't want to mess with one, honestly, because one knocked me around pretty good one day. Yes, I've had tangled with wolves, and that's about all I'd like to know. <laughs> there you go. I don't even want to know the wolves, dang. <laughs> we just stay in the city where you're safe, Cardigan. Don't you worry. Yeah, I like it here. Tough folk like us farmers will be out and out there in the wilds and the colds with the bears and the weasels. I am an honorary farmer. Thank you very much. He is, you know. We set him up. We got him a little cabin and everything out there. I'd appreciate yeah. your coming to visit one of these days. Maybe, maybe once I get everything going, we could. We could have a little, uh, a little thing out there for the whole congregation. No, oh, yes, yes, that'd be great. Yeah, the last time I went out there, no one had yet settled in there. I explored it a little bit. Oh yeah, at least you know where it's at. That's for. Oh, well, yes, it's sir. filling up nice and quick. Did see my oh. first giant sloth out there. Oh time. yeah, they're big cuddle they monsters. They are amazing. I would love to have one as a pet. I tell you what, I keep it in my house, and we just sit and lay around on the on, on the floor together by the fire and just stay warm and cuddly. Mo was talking about uh, trying to use one as a bed. See, that's what I was thinking. They look so comfortable just to lay down on, <laughs> like a giant sheep <clears throat> dog. Oh yeah. Might be I'll kind of smelly, but... <laughs> oh, yeah. You get used to that on the farm. Oh, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. That is very true. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, I'm going to go see how Gemma's coming along. She's got plans. She's going to try and tell me them, and I'm like, maybe you should just do it, darling, because I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> right. We're gonna Is we're gonna make a little. Get it on? That's right. We're gonna have a little farmer market right there by the by the uh, market, you know, for foods and such and stuff. Yeah, it's gonna be quite nice. Oh yeah, that'd be great. Oh yeah. Uh, I bet you'll fetch a good pin before your carrots. That way, the stable hens can actually get wholesome. Yeah, yeah. Well, I made a little deal with them, and, and they're they're getting a little starting uh, pile of hor of, of carrots, and uh, then I'm gonna get you know a little more profit from them. But right now, I want I want them to I want them to be able to do their job. 
Andy wants to find a steed they get. Well, yeah, that's possibly part of it. (laughs) 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 I do want a really good steed. I can kick the crap out of those wolves. That Baz is a quick worker, too. I noticed he already had himself two horses, and it was just not like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes ago. It feels like he, he got them carrots. Oh, I believe it. Well, there's a hundred of them out right outside the damn door. Oh, that, yeah, that, that, that true words have not been spoken, that is for sure. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm excited. I sure could use a mouth. I'm getting tired, though, fellas. I'm also getting tired. I gotta gotta go put some saddles on some megaloceros and then maybe get a little ore to smelt before I head I head to bed. Uh, did you buy my freaking donkey? I was about to. You're you're getting a steed. I know, but I still might want the donkey. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm on your way, riding. All right, fellas. You have yourself a fine day. Oh, see you later, car again. I gotta get some sleep too. Thank you all for the hosts. Thank you all for scaring the crap out of me. I hope everyone's having a fine day. I'm looking forward to another fantastic day in uh, Bastion. I, I wanted to stream early tomorrow, but I think I'm just going to go late tonight and take the morning off tomorrow. Actually, I might just take tomorrow off in general. I'll be on, but I don't know if I'll be streaming. I I, I got a lot of responsibility as being in charge of the blacksmith, so I should probably be on a little bit at least. Mr. Coltrane taking some time off. Oh, I also have all these notes to read before bed. Um, yeah, and, we'll, and we'll get some carrots for sale down here. here uh, hopefully within six hours. Uh oh, am I lost again? Oh, oh, I hope I find the right order for that. Oh, wow, it's coming along really good. Good morning, Fisk. Thanks for the follow earlier, by the way. Um, yeah, <laughs> man, it's getting late. Welcome to the coalition, my friend. And we we have a clip of you running by. <laughs> oh man, thank you, Hallowfest, for the follow. Welcome to the coalition. <laughs> Verified streamer in the house. Verified. How do you get one of them? That's fancy. That's real fancy. Oh uh, yeah, I think that's a fine idea. We have a <laughs> we have a clip from my stream earlier of you running by, <laughs> chasing the pig. It's great. Let's see if I can uh, pull it down and put it in there. Let's see. uh, Right here. Oh, I don't know why that didn't work, Peachy, but I can do it right now. Uh, Shout out to Streamer. And uh, just Fisk, right? Oh, that worked. It just took a second. Excellent, excellent. Thank you for the follow, Hallowfest. Welcome to the coalition. What do you think? Uh, your soul is mine. That's a wonderful idea. Oh, oh yeah, that that clip right there, I believe, is of you. <laughs> Um, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, I dropped some of this stuff down off. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to risk it. We're going to have a, a, a sound of people out here. And hopefully, you'll be able to get some more spirits. So, we'll let it come Oh, me too. Me too. Oh, man, it's been a great day. Great day in Bastion. 
Got a whole ton of, uh, of blacksmiths in. <laughs> nice. <laughs> How was the server? Well, I slept for two hours. <laughs> it's been fantastic. I got to see Coltrane. Um, and uh, met a whole mess of people. There's a whole bunch of them. That clip is great. <laughs> oh, man. I'll have to do that as well. Hey, Abe. Abe, I thought I heard you still. You still around here, Abe? Oh, what? I mean, I'm not a farmer. I'm just saying, isn't that what a farmer's wife is? A bunch of chores and how's it? Can't get over this fence. Oh, heck yeah. That's exactly what it is. I can get over that fence. I got I got I'm some seed for you guys. Oh good, thank you, buddy. We can always use more seed. There you are. I wanted to catch you before you headed off to bed, and I'm about to go get some ore real quick and then go to bed. Oh, thank you, Cardigan. Well, you Come some good back. Are you heading out, out of town to get ore? Oh, yep, yep, I'm going to have to do that. I, I got to get some smelting before I go to bed, and I don't know. Uh, I might maybe find Sophie. Maybe she can help me out, too, but uh, I need I need to get some ore. I got a lot of orders and all that. Oh, yeah, sounds I good. Carry a hundred of that stuff. It's, like... it's quite oh, heavy. Yeah. A lot of running. All right, y'all, you guys have a fine day. All right, Cardigan, I'll see you later. I might head on out to the farm. Yeah, I know. I was uh, a little wary, but when I got on, there was like 13 or, four, or Actually, I think there might have been 16 people on. So, I mean, it's awesome that it's going to be 24 hours to get on any time. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. What was I doing? I'm going to do something. As you can see, I've, I've been up for too long. <laughs> oh, I have some extra hiding here, too. All right, that's all. I'm going to get some ore real quick. Take some meat with me, just in case. Wow, that's great. I really hope so. How long have you been on now? Um, I have been on tonight uh, three and a half hours almost. I, I did a five-hour stream this morning. There's a bunch of people, uh, newcomers. They just got here. A few new guards. Uh, they're all, uh, all right, everybody's getting set up. It's real nice. Real freaking nice. You said in about six hours. About six hours. Are you going to be around? It is fantastic. Fantastic. Man, that's a nice white steed. I like that. <laughs> uh. Oh, hi howdy, Father. Time to weather the outside world. rather the hunters go out and, and get me some ore but uh, they can't provide it fast enough and uh, they're all getting settled and all that let's see uh, we'll put another one into here real quick put one of these saddles on you on the other hand I might not want to put a saddle on all of them let's see this one over here is mine now too oh look there's rare flowers on it
this one. Charcoal getting a little crazy. Oh, no. Unfortunately, the RP is not going to be uh, as vibrant outside of the city. Oh, greetings. Oh, hello there. That you, Gavin? Yes. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm just out in the boat looking around. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Well, you stay safe. I'll just check in, checking you out, making sure everything's all right. Yeah, luckily, everything's been fine. I still haven't seen any wolves, luckily. Oh, yes. Uh, you got you to gotta travel a little farther out of the city, and you'll find plenty of wolves. But this whole direction this way, this is pretty safe for quite a while. Once you get towards the water this way, though, you'll find yourself lots of saber cats and other things. Okay, I'll try and uh, keep an eye out for that then. Yeah, it's quite a ways though. I mean, most most of the areas right around Bastion right here are quite safe, which is pretty much a good thing. People can gather uh, some meat and some hide pretty easily. All right. Well, I really appreciate letting me know about that uh, that lake over there then. Yep, yep. There's oh, some water safe, over though. there. What was that? Well, do travel safe though, wherever you're headed. Oh, most definitely. Just going to go get some ore real quick so I get it smelting while I sleep. Mm, okay. Good luck, Mr. Gavin. Oh, let's hope indeed. Ice is so dang fast. Crap, I should have unloaded the other one. I surely hope I don't get a teleporting tree. Let's probably make one of them fancy. Oh, wait, I got a coat. There we are. Peachy's always got loads of work. Nice soothing, nice soothing music. I don't know if you guys can hear that. Oh, looks like someone's already out here. I, I 
I see. Why are you following charcoal? It's a weird thing for you to be doing, that's for sure. Yeah, out of my way, dang horse. <laughs> nice. I just love how smooth the game is on this map. Yep, yep. Not. What was that? Cheated using mounts. <laughs> what do you mean cheating? Three mounts, and here I am running on foot. <laughs> yep, yep. I, I've been around for quite a while. I know what's up. I like. I see that you found a nice location, though. This is the, probably the best location. <laughs> yeah. The gold is and stuff. Yep, I seen some gold too. I've yet to find any of that silver though. Hopefully I'll be able to get my mount later today. Yeah, they definitely come in handy, that's for sure. Uh the first one I got for free because I I, I, I uh, helped out the Lord Silver quite a bit. He uh, I got him all geared up and I and I uh Helped him tame and get get the ingots he needed and everything. Uh, the next one, I think I paid like uh, I got really good deals on them because it was before uh, they, they they knew their prices. So I think I paid like 200 for this one, and then I just got this one. This one was real cheap too. I, it was only 135. I'm not sure you're gonna be able to find deals like this though because they're starting to wise up and, and raise the prices. I do believe prices of everything are going up all around the city. Yeah. Oh, I needed to drink the wall before I came up here. You need what? I needed to drink the wall before I came up here. Here, you can take a hit off this here water jar. Yes, of course. No worries. I got it. Yep, we got to take care of each other here in, in this city, greatest city of Bastion. Yes, yes. If I can get at, if I can get out of here, holy crap! You said you weren't gonna have a, have have room for all this. No, no, this is all that's completely closed. Oh, all right. Thank you kindly. Mr. Zachary, you have a safe trip back home. Yeah, it's a, a little bit Oh, most definitely. I'd much rather have hunters out here getting this stuff for me than me have to get out here by myself, that's for sure. Oh man, what, how'd you get down there? You guys need to calm down.
Come on, Icy. We got things to do, people to see. Can't be up here all day. Full. He's got some berries. You, sir, are a berry. <laughs> Coffee is lovely. Hey, that's a good name for this one. Coffee, the best berry ever. Looks like coffee here is a little over encumbered. Coffee! That's me on coffee. Seriously, I can't even drink this stuff. I flail out, going all crazy. Whoops. Oh, oh that works. Mr. Pudwhacker out here next to all the metal. Son of a gun. Looks like we may be stopping for a bit. place where we can sell hide meat and such <clears throat> uh, I do know there's a marketplace I'll be right back
<laughs> yes, my pet. Come a day when no armists will need the, that gold coin. <laughs> I'm gonna be the best shot, Miss Sarah. Sarah. Whew. This blizzard's going on for quite some time now. It is Zara. <laughs> Normus doesn't know. That's perfect timing. I can blame all on him. Love it. <laughs> Deer, get out of my way. <clears throat> Nighty night, muchacho. Wifey woke up, and we're going to look at the moon together. Have fun, everyone. <laughs> night, Corungeon. Thank you for stopping by, and uh, Abe is awesome. Good night, Abe. Can't wait for another uh, fun-filled day tomorrow. I should probably get be going to sleep too. Yeah, it's been great. Abe is amazing. I think you're even better this season. You really got Abe figured out. You rock, sir. You rock. <laughs> uh, that emote's awesome. That emoji. You guys are sure taking your sweet time, that's for sure. Come on, coffee. You got we gotta get back to town, get this melted down. Yeah. 
it's a long journey on foot when you're over encumbered just a tiny bit but it, it'll be worth it in the end it's almost a straight shot doing your antlers are too big to get through there silly Whew. going on four hours now not bad I've come back to streaming hard back to the city Music's quite appropriate. Appropriate. I can't even talk no more. <laughs> Getting tired. I'm all jacked up on this Dr. Pepper. Make me feel good. city we're almost there see this is why I rather not do this myself ain't nobody got time for this except people who get paid to have time for this like them hunters I see the banners, I see the the statues. We're real close like. I've been saying that for the last five minutes, but it's true now. No arm, this is a master hunter who help you out <laughs> help you cap it. Uh yep, I need lots and lots of ore and all the obsidian you can carry. here use this I imagine you're gonna have a lot of work now because there's a whole bunch of blacksmiths now doors supposed to stay closed I noticed they're closed at night like when it's super late for me like it's like two o'clock in the morning for me right now uh, I notice they're closed but like whenever I get there during the day where you go 
What happened to you? Nothing. Why, why are you naked, sir? Uh, testing something for science. Oh, very good. Oh, all right, sir. I'm just making sure you're all good. Now, how much metal did you actually bring back? Probably around 600. Maybe 700. A lot. Okay. Well, uh, I'll let you go do that. All right, sir. You have yourself a good day. Good luck with your experimentation. One day I'll learn how to use this other smelter and what it does. So many trips. <laughs> oh, hello there. Good morning. Good morning. Yes, yes. I'm doing all right. Actually, I'm getting ready to go to bed actually it's been a long day for me lots of new blacksmiths actually i got put in charge of the blacksmiths it's pretty crazy it's been a hectic day how are you miss ariel i'm fine i'm uh, just woke up i'm still a bit tired yep yep it's good to see you awake and uh, doing well looks like you've got a nice caravan going here Oh yeah, yeah. I, I gotta take take matters in my own hands sometimes when the hunters aren't providing the things I need. It's been so busy with all the newcomers, there's been so many new people, and I, I just been running out of metal real fast. Might have to yeah, increase the price I, for the ingots. Yeah, and I ran out of everything else because yesterday was so much to build. <laughs> Yes, yes. Hello. I didn't hey, recognize Kurgan. you without your What's going camera? on, Mr. Pudwhacker? <laughs> hey, uh, 
uh, Lord Hemlock said to make sure you checked your mailbox yesterday before he left because he had to go on a journey for a few days. Oh, and, yeah. Uh, be acting, uh, yeah, okay. He, I actually caught him. Uh, I, I woke up and I went to the bank and I saw, uh, 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 who was it, Mr. Snook, and he was like, all the blacksmiths are over at the, the Hall of Justice or whatever it's called, and they're all having a meeting, and nobody told me. So I ran over there, and he told me I'm going to be late the, in charge now or something for a few days. Oh, yes, we had a big influx of blacksmiths tonight. It was quite amazing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I uh, I finally got a mount. I, got, I left some metal in there for you. I'm going to work on getting more today, but... Uh, is there anything else you need besides uh, metal ore? <clears throat> oh, I'm in desperate need of obsidian, it would seem. There's, there, there's some new fancy shields I can make for the guards, and it, it takes a whole lot of obsidian. Oh, all right. All right. I got a little bit, but I'll, uh, I don't know. I got maybe, well, how much Well, how much does it make to take one shield so I make sure I keep getting enough for you? It takes a shit ton. I mean, like, I, I need 200 for each sheet. 200? Okay. All right. That gives me an idea then. All right. Because I think I got at least six or right now. Great. Oh, very nice. I'll pay you handsomely for that. I'll give you the same deal I gave to Sophie. I'm giving a 75. What was that? I can understand you. You're freaking up. Oh, apologies. Apologies. Is this better? Yes, much All right. Well, I'm, I, I told Sophie I'd give her 75 uh, coin for each stack she brings me. All right. Um, where I have to go, uh, um, where I have to go to get a sit uh, uh, is pretty bad. Can I, I have, uh, well, actually, you don't do that. Uh, I need another uh, crossbow. It's, uh, yeah, they break so easy, the primitive, that... Uh, I, and it's it's real dangerous out there where I got to go get it. Oh, did you all find right, yourself? Did you figure. find yourself some big some big rocks? Because we've been picking them up off the ground. Yeah, I was going to say that along the beach over to the uh, uh, yeah the yeah the beach can yeah yeah that's uh, that, that that's where I start at. But there is a place with big rocks, but it's very it, it's a long distance. I'm trying to get a mammoth and. Uh, once I can do that and get him, you know, aged up a little bit, I'm hoping to go out to where some other resources are. Oh, also, do you have use for silver? Because I found out where to get silver at, but it's, it's also very dangerous. Most definitely. Do you, you wouldn't happen to have a little silver on you right now. Look, look I think I do. How much do you need? Uh, how much do you need, Father? You th I think it, uh, Miss Cora said it was like three ingots or something. Um, one second. Oh, that's a fancy helmet you got there, Mr. Zachary. Some fine work you do there. Yeah. Oh, hello there. Yeah. Hello. Um, what we would need total? I mean, for the bench, it's three silver ingots, and um, for the brewer barrel, it's also another three silver ingots as well. So. All right. That's well, whatever, whatever right he uh, uh, brings me, I'll, I'll give to you too. Get you guys up and running. Oh, okay. Thank you, sir. Most definitely. Most definitely. Oh, I was wrong. I don't have any silver on me. But I do have 160 of skin that I, I, I got on me right now. So I'm moving a little slow. Oh, yeah. oh, you can go ahead and put it in this box if you want, and I can go get you your money. I'll go, Father, I'll go get that silver here, and just as soon as I get some food cooked, I'll go get that silver. What's your name, man? Oh, I know, hurry. Oh, we have another, right? Oh, I got some spare meat there, if you need right? a couple stacks. Um, yeah, yeah that would work. It, that'll set you up. My name's Zachary. Nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you, too. Hey, Father. Mr. Pudwhacker, I'm gonna stick him in this here box. Alright. Alright. 
spot. There you go. All right, and I'm going to give you like, hold on, uh, 75 for one stack. Uh, I'll give you like 110 gold for that, that obsidian. All right. I'll just transfer it into your account. All right, sounds good. All right. I'll go get the silver first, and then from there I'll start working on metal and obsidian. Um, if you ever get a mammoth, then it'll be even better, and you won't be so stressed for supplies. Mm -mm. Oh, most definitely. Also, I mean, we can spread the love around. Uh, I do need that right quick, but uh, once you uh, get me settled in, feel free to uh, spread the, the, the love over to the other blacksmiths. We got a whole bunch. Uh, I seen like eight of them last night. Mm -hmm. All right. And, uh, yeah, because it's a matter of finding out where they're located and everything, and you know, all they got to do is, like you do, set me up a, a cabinet with a pen, and then uh, I can work on it for them. Oh, Once most definitely. A couple, I, my goal is to get at least two or three mammoths, because when I go out, I, I you know, I, I, I like dealing in quality. Mm -hmm, and uh, so, yeah, I like to keep, I'm a war horse, so I like keeping everybody, you know, supplied. Oh, very Either I had good. like six or eight hundred. 600 rotten meat for you and I couldn't find you yesterday. I don't know if you went to sleep or what, so but, but I'll, I'll work on getting you some more rotten meat if you're going to be awake a while. <clears throat> Alright, I'm going to take off and go get that stuff. Alright, Mr. Pudwacker, you be safe out there. How to go my experiment look? How'd that experiment go? Uh, oh, Mr. Car Your Mr. hair's Car coming in real nice. Yes, Mr. Pudwacker. Right. I, I forgot. Uh, Firestone, you interested in that? Oh, I am, but I, I don't know uh, exactly what I'm going to pay for that yet. I, I've yet to find a quite, uh, I mean, I, I use it to make the fancy alloys, I believe, but I haven't found a use for it yet. If you want to All put right, it in the box, though, I, put, I can start keeping a tab of what you give me. All right, because I, I put some in, in my table for sale, but I put it at a real high price because I just didn't know what to put it at. So, but we can figure that out later. Yes, most definitely. I forgot to ask uh, Mr. Hamlock uh, what, what the more advanced stuff is like. Uh, I do believe it's asleep now, though. Yeah, mm -hmm. All right, no problem. I'll just keep collecting it, and then we'll, we'll go from there. Most definitely, most definitely. Cardigan, if you look at the, um, the cost for our nickel stuff, it is an alloy I haven't even seen the mithril cost stuff. Is that in my regular smithy? Having a good back day. No. Yesterday I had a almost like a eight hundred to a thousand uh, rotten meat, but I couldn't find you, and I didn't have a place to put it to, to keep it from spoiling. Oh, okay, okay. I think I ended up giving it to Doc Wicklock, but I'll work on getting you some more. Are you gonna be awake for a while today? No, no, I'm probably winding down here shortly. All right, but I will be around. Um, oh, I see. I get some rest. Oh, I see. I see what you're talking back about on, now. I, or be back oh, I see. I see what you're talking yeah. about now. I haven't um, quite uh, looked at that. I'm definitely well, not well, take a look. Well, right when I'm the the science experiment is this. I'm using that. I, 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 how yes. much? Oh, for sure. Yeah, well, I got. I, I got the same thing going on. Um, Pick up only made yeah. about 88 uh, cement and paste. Like this, I've been doing that since the beginning because I want some fancy tattoos oh, like yourself, and I, I like showing off this fine I specimen got. of a body I have. How much cotton do you need for it? Yeah, yeah. Well, Blacksmith that keeps us quite fit, God, that's for sure. How much it takes? That is indeed. Oh, I like that. A hat, that's fancy. One or two. Oh my. Where, where, oh. where did you get that? I know it's more than check. one. Come here. That's four, actually. See my eyes? Where, where did you get all these toys? I, I I need myself some fancy stuff. Need some fancy stuff? I got this. <laughs> That's great. Oh, 
head out of Kona. All right, yeah, oh. I got seven in the table, or six Hello. in the table uh, here, and I got seven good on morning. me. Good morning. Good morning, Ariel. Not sure what. Oh right man, you're getting me all excited. Sure God, tell me how to get one. some of that. Yeah, this one. Uh, a little secret. Get, and I, I didn't know what. Do, do the tailors make them kind of stuff fire. out? No. By that stack, I got seven more on me. I'll give you. Where'd you get all oh, that wait, stuff? Big like tall pack. Yeah, I like that. That that's nice and fancy. I need that for some formal days. Yeah. Um, you got very important busy three days. Like I said, oh I yes, do, oh yeah, yes. I'm not sure what's a good price. So. Yeah, thank you. Oh nice. Thank you very very much. That's very kind of you. Yeah, it's been very hard to come by because I've. No problem. Every time I go out, I might. Right. I'll leave you to it. All right, Mr. Zachary. Good luck with your experimentation and everything. Where is he getting all those? <laughs> yeah. Going back to uh, probably do a bit more tightering. Um, but, um, I'll look into that and see. Um, sure. It's probably going to be a doctor that's going to eat it. Well, uh, I think... Uh, I didn't know we had access to skins. I know I... I need a, a, a Rickon well or two made, and I think it takes a minute to make some. Um, yeah, that can take about 60 or 70 days. I don't really need a lot of it, though. Like, it's just... Okay. It's like, again, I didn't charge for it. I just stuck it in this 50 piece. Um, I think it was 75 gold. What's up, Ducky? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yeah, I put 50 for 75 gold, but again, uh, You're little catching the end of my stream. You know, I can... Um, I'm getting tired. And the other problem is to get it, I have to go through... Uh, I believe I really Cole Rungeon has my, gone uh, to bed. He uh, is, uh, with the wifey... Or actually, they're, they're watching the moon together, or the sun together, or one of the two. Yeah, as I'm logging in. <laughs> yep, it's been a long time. I've, I've been streaming for four hours. I'll be on again tomorrow, though. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to be able to get in sync. Didn't I see you last night? Yeah, you did. For a very short moment, yes, you did. I can't remember if I had to. The prices on flak have gone up exponentially. They're angry. Kerrigan? I guess you punched the fence, right? Ow, oh, they hit me too. It's uh -oh. everything. Far too aggressive. It's that is one angry type horse. It's supposed Sorry, to be someone a very me? docile state of mind. Well, um, just fell warnings to him. I fell oh, warnings to him. Do that. That, doesn't, that doesn't know. Um, any time you see the um, uh, just the the message that comes above your head about an animal wipe or anything like that, every time it does that, oh. all the animals Friendly are person. in a neutral state. Just letting you know. That's some good information. Are you able to make yes, Mister um, Pub Yeah, I didn't know I that. Before get off of it. Did you, did you forget to check my cabinet last night? Because uh, oh, no, there's a good uh, six or eight hundred uh, iron ore in there. I don't want you to start attacking oh, very nice. Yeah, I have not. Uh, apology. Uh, let's see. Uh, I can get you paid for that right up, too. Uh, that's one. All right. Uh, I, I could use some ingots, too. Oh, most but, definitely. You know, you know. I'll pay you for three stacks, and I'll melt down the other, uh, the last stack for ingots. 
All right, thank you. You can just put it back in there, and if you can just transfer the, 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 the funds in the bank, and I'll go take off and start getting you some goods. Oh, most excellent, most excellent. So, yeah, so that's another 75 on top of the 110. Before we take off, could you uh, repair my tools real quick? Yep, yep, I got you. Come on in. Stick them, out, stick them in this box here. All right, but you're good. What do you charge to repair? Oh, for hunters, the the well, at least uh, what 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 are we talking about? The regular tools are free for hunters. No, a sword. I oh, finally a got a sword. sword. I gotta look at my paperwork. Yeah. I haven't used it yet, but I'm going to probably <laughs> now that I'm going after this other stuff, it'll probably be getting used a bunch. Oh, most definitely, most definitely. <laughs> uh, yep, that's probably not yeah, a good that, idea. That's a pretty good note. Pretty good note to put up at the top of that list, I do believe. Mm -hmm. I mean, I just wanted to, to smell it, see if it was going to turn food and stuff. And yeah. <laughs> well, I, I, uh, you know, I, I live out in the woods and, and I'm around a lot of different animals, and I got to tell you, I ain't never had that thought. No, mm -mm. Would, would, wouldn't occurred to me. Uh, but yeah, okay. You know, if you eat your own. Mm -hmm. So, did you get a flowery options off of that horse? It's terrible. Okay. Hi, <laughs> <Bye>, Monty. <laughs> I, I, I do believe I'm charged 20 gold to repair swords. All right, thank you. I, like I said, I don't. I, I got a brand new one, but I just wanted. To... Yes, yes, of course, of course. Stick them back in here. They're good as new. Thank you, sir. Did I All pick right, up the I'm rest, go rest of that obsidian? I must have. All right. Excellent, sir. And I'll get that money transferred right before I go to sleep. All right. Thank you. All right. I'm going to have to charge... A ridiculous amount for these freak or for this uh these shields scarred shields um, <clears throat> I do believe I do believe nothing else in there oh I can get this metal over here huh oh man this will take forever too can I carry 200 at a time? I cannot. Hopefully I can carry 150 though. Yeah, that's better. Better than just 100. One stack of 167.
Whoops. Six. More of a round number. So what's that one? One sixty six. So he gets 70 and gets back. I could do that before I go to bed. Got transfer some of that money. One ten plus seventy five, so one eighty five, right? That's three stacks, yeah. Mr. Pud Whacker. Ten for one hundred and sixty obsidian. I think that's what it was. I think I might have given him a little bit more, but uh, I guess that'll work for now. And then 75 for three stacks of metal ore. There we go. All right, all right, all right. Let's see, is anyone else streaming Bastion right now? There's no one else streaming Bastion right now. Is Alistair just still streaming Bastion? Let's find out. Hey, Bushman. Looks like he is. We're going to host him. Thank you all for stopping by. It's been an amazing evening. Let's see. See how to do this. It's been wonderful. Thank you all for all the hosts. It's been great, fantastic. This new season on Bastion is beautiful. Thank you, uh, People's Game and Peachy, all of you, the whole crew, doing such an amazing job. Um, you guys are all fantastic. Have a good night. 
I hope that worked. I hope I'm doing this right. I don't. I, I've never really hosted anybody. Let's try it again. I love you all, and have a good night. Have a splendiferous day. Come